It says you're live. Am I live? People will tell me. Tell me, internet. <gasps> oh my god, it's playing. So it is working because it's playing on my phone because I had it open on my phone. Yay, I think it's working. Hi, guys. How are you? Yay, I'm so excited. We do this every year. This is that's my mom. No, mom, <laughs> I'm introducing you. Get in. Everyone can be in it. I don't want to be alone. That's my mom's here. Corey is here. And come in, say hi. Everyone's so quiet and shy right now. Come in. This is my brother Trent is here. <laughs> and come in. Eric is here. And my dad is here. So there's a bunch of people here to celebrate this live stream. If you are watching this, you're watching this live, hi. I'm so excited you're here. Thank you for joining. It means so much to me. If you're watching this after um, it's already over, don't worry. You can still donate. Um, and <laughs> what are you doing, Mom? <laughs> um, and you can still help and uh, raise money for kids with cancer. So uh, let me just make sure it worked my phone, but I'm making sure it's working everywhere else in the world. So give me a second. So. I'm checking my Twitter really fast to see. Um, okay, so I think it's working. Yeah. Oh, Jeeps, it's freezing, someone said. Oi, 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 oi. I hope it's not freezing. I'll turn my Wi-Fi off my phone. Sometimes there's too many <coughs> things on Wi-Fi. We'll see if that helps. Um, okay, so here's the tea, y'all. Basically, every year for my birthday, Moose, see, I think Rachel's here. Moose, double hey. barky. Good boy. Good boy. Oh, no. It's good enough. Um, <laughs> <laughs> close enough to not barking. Um, Rachel's here. Hi. Sorry, I'm like... It's okay. Come get a chair and be with me because everyone else was scared to be in the live stream with me. What in the world? They're all hiding. Live streams are so great. So everyone's just watching me from afar. And not... You stole Corey's chair. Okay, you said no one else was gonna be on the live stream. So grab a chair. I immediately get yelled at. <laughs> so this okay. is how it's going to work. Um, basically, every side. single year for my birthday, every single year being the last, I think this is the fourth year I've done it. Um, I raise money for kids with cancer and their families um, because being on tour, I've met so many of you guys, um, and I've met a lot of wonderful people going on tour, uh, and some of them struggle with cancer and are fighting cancer. And I don't think it's fair that kids get any disease or ever get sick, but especially cancer, it's so brutal. So um, we started doing these fundraisers to raise money for kids and their families who are fighting cancer because the government, I don't know if you guys know this, but they don't give them a lot of money to help them. So uh, the families are left with tons of hospital bills. They lose their jobs because they're at the hospital so much. Um, they can't afford to pay their rent. They can't afford to pay electricity bills. They can barely afford to pay for their kids' medical bills because the government doesn't give uh, that much money to kids who are struggling with cancer in the hospital. So that's why I, I like to do this. And so for my birthday, this is what I choose to do. Instead of getting presents and things for myself, I don't need anything. Um, I ask you guys to help and donate and give money to kids who need it more than us. And I think the most important thing you can learn um, from the live sh these fundraisers that we do is that the littlest bit helps. I think a lot of people think like, oh, well, I only have you know a little bit of money to give. It's not going to do anything, so I'm not going to donate. And that is so not true. And I'll tell you how it's not true. I'm going to read to you all the things that you guys have done in the past to help people. A lot of times you donate money and you're like, well, I don't know if where that went. And I don't know if my money helped anyone. And that's a little frustrating when you're donating your money to someplace, but I make sure to let you guys know where the money goes. So I have a list of all the people you've helped with your money and how you've helped them. And so I'm going to tell you exactly how your $10, your $20, your $100, your $5, your any dollars has helped people. And if you don't have money to spare, that's okay. There's other ways to help. You can spread this live stream around to people and um, right now and spread the word and that's helping. You can spread the link to the fundraiser and that's helping. Or you can donate your time to your local hospital um, and hang out with kids, read books to them, play with them, paint with them. I've done that multiple times. I love it. Um, and it doesn't cost anything to do that. You don't have to spend any money. You just spend some time with kids who 
want a friend at the hospital who are stuck in a hospital. Um, you can also donate time to a local charity. There's lots of ways to help that's not just giving money. So a way to say thank you to people who donate, um, I'm gonna give away prizes today. So if you donate the smallest amount of money, you can still, Rachel's taking pictures, oh my god. Because I'm gonna post on my I Insta love it. story. No, no, I'm happy you are, I was like, that was okay. happiness. Um, <clears throat> so I have a bunch of prizes back there. I bought some cool stuff. Every year I usually just give away like stuff from Miranda videos or whatever, and I'm doing that this year, but I also bought some cool prizes to give away as well. Like a record player, a Polaroid camera, stuff from Bath and Body Works, stuff from Lush, like Starbucks. there's a lot of Starbucks. And then there's also a lot of stuff from Haters Back Off. Um, I brought a packet of Rachel things. brought a packet of things. In a Ziploc bag. <laughs> that is the classiest of class. <laughs> I didn't want to get dirty in my backpack. I love it. Um, so how you can win one of those things is you just donate and um, we're going to pick people at random. And for the people who can't donate money, I am going to pick a couple winners of people who just share this live stream because that's a way to help too. So you don't just have to spend money to possibly win something. You share the live stream, you share the fundraiser, get the word out there. That's helping. And I want you guys to see that that helps too. So I want to reward people who do that as well. Okay. I just talked a lot. <laughs> uh, my mom is jumping. She's <laughs> She's excited. So I think we should just get started. So the link to the fundraiser is in the bio of this video. So it should be the only thing in this video bio description. So you can click on that and it'll take you to the fundraiser. And you guys are amazing. Hold on. I'm going to pull up the link really quick. Here. I'm so, by the way, anyone who was confused this morning by my 800 live streams that started, I'm so sorry. I was desperately trying to figure out how to do this, and I'm it, just, it's really confusing. The it's so confusing. Stuff, I started like, like five minutes. I, do it, it, yeah. I started like three live streams. Yeah, it takes it's and every annoying. and then I did I posted like a five second video. The instructions and don't make sense. No, and then like, like enable code. a five second video. I felt like I went live and I was just breathing. I was like, because I couldn't breathe this morning. And then I deleted it. So hot mess. Um, okay. I'm going to get a soda. So let me see. The cat? The cat? No, but I hope no one's allergic to cats who wins anything. Oh my God. My cat's sitting on the prices right now. You guys have already raised $26,000. Oh <laughs> That is crazy! Oh I, my god! That was like close. When did you make thirty thousand? Like two years ago? Like so that my was first year, I think I made thirty-ish or something. And then the last couple of years, I made like forty, forty-five. Overall, we've raised one hundred thirty thousand dollars over the last few years. So, yeah, the first year I think it was twenty yeah, or something. So it's really like oh my amazing. gosh, you guys are amazing. All right, so here's how it goes. Um, you can donate, you can write a little message when you donate, you can donate anonymously, um, and then you will get a message from Corey, um, from our email saying you won the prize. I'll announce it here and then Corey will message you. So if someone's not watching and they win, they're still going to get an email and a message saying that they won. And Corey will ask you for your address and you send him your full name, your address, your full address. Sometimes people just send like their the street, street. <laughs> and then we can't get it to you. You just send us your full address and um, we'll ship it out. Mm -hmm. And I will sign things and I will write you a little letter saying thank you. And um, that's how it works. So right now we're gonna pick someone from the actual donation page. And then throughout the live stream, I'll pick people on Twitter who show that they've donated. I'll pick people who just wrote a message. I'll pick people who are sharing the link right now on Twitter and Instagram. So there's lots of different ways to be entered to win. It could be. Anybody at any time. Let's pick the first thing that we're going to do. So let's, oh my gosh, get Gus off of the prizes. Oh my God. Um, okay, what should we do first? He's mad. Oh my God. Is there a link for the lunch stream? Yeah, go to her I just Twitter. tweeted it. Um, and then double press it. And then oh my gosh, he's like, flying everything. He does not so want to get off. He's so mad right now. Let's get I'll away. Oh, oh my gosh, I've never seen him like that. I know. There. Let's start off with. And then you'll hit. I don't know. I, I, this is always the hard part for me is picking what to give away. I don't know why it's so hard to that do. And then I'll send you a link and you're going to Let's do a book link and, and link and the Lush box. box. Yeah. Ooh. And we'll give away a pair of socks. <laughs> so just copy that link. <laughs> so this is the Lush box and it has, um, I don't want to open it because it's so cute, but oh, it says what's inside. So inside it has 
a cheery Christmas bath bomb, a magic wand reusable bubble bar, starlight starbright luxury bath melt, snowflake sparkle jar. I don't know what any of this is. <laughs> Snow fairy shower gel and shooting soap stars soap. Basically, a it, lot oh, of bath really bombs. Cute. This is what it looks like. There's all those little things inside there. And I'm also in this will also be a book, one of my diaries that I will sign. All oh, what? And, what? All yeah, one. Oh, one. oh, we got a lot of prizes. And these socks, which there's a very nice yeah. of these socks. So we have a bunch of these because when we went on tour, there's a bunch of merch that we sold on tour. And the merch people were like, and in the long email of merch, they're like, do you want this kind of merch, this kind of merch, this kind of merch? And I was approving things and not approving things. And there was miscommunication because they wanted to do these socks. And I was like, I don't want the socks. They're supposed to be Crocs in white socks and then the red pants, but it it doesn't really look like no. that. And I remember seeing them being like, oh, that's kind of confusing. I don't know what those are. So I said, no to those, but there's miscommunication and it was my fault. Like I didn't write it out in the email properly. So they thought I said yes to like a lot of these socks. Like I wanted millions of these socks. And so we have millions of these socks. For so real? if you yes. win anything, you want some socks. you're getting some I'll take socks. Some crack socks. <laughs> So that's a certain kind of these, and they're like an ongoing joke in this house. Like these socks, like these boxes and boxes of these socks. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Here we go. Um, how do I do this? Oh, this is always the this hardest is part. The dashboard. Do you want to go to your page? Yeah. So I'm picking things on Corey's thingy, and, and then and that's running very fast. On so the front door. Thanks, Thanks, so. Um. Okay. Um. So if I look at the messages, oh, you can see where people are donating. That's so cool. There's people in Australia, all over America. How do I go to like the messages? Mm -hmm. I want to read the message. Oh. Oh. Mm -hmm. That is weird. Load more. Sorry, we're trying to figure out. So, okay. I'll explain that after. Um. Oh, I hate this part because everyone's so sweet in their messages. This part's so hard. I'm such a bad That's why you have a million prizes. Ask Eric how easy it is to do something like pick lunch. Mm -hmm. Like, it is every day. He, like, his, the worst part of the day for Eric is when we have to decide what to have for lunch because I just can't pick. Like, I'm horrible at this. Um, <laughs> let's see. Rachel, that was my prize to you guys. How about this person? Nevianette Batista commented with a $1 donation. I wish I had more to give, but I really hope it helps. It does help. And to show you and say thank you, I'm sending you this. And um, I saw some people saying they couldn't donate less than $10. I think it depends on your region and where you live because some places they want to charge like a fee for credit card stuff. So some places, the minimum is a dollar. Some places, the minimum is $10. There's nothing I can do about that. It's not on my control. So, um, But I just want to show you guys that any amount helps. So $1 is plenty, and you can win something, and you can help someone even with $1. So you get all this stuff. Um, there we go. Oh, my gosh. There's a lot happening over there. So I wanted to mention that. <laughs> Corey has to really let them know he's not a robot. <laughs> yeah, every time. Send a message. <clears throat> okay. So then do you get a message back to this thing or to the email? I think it comes to this email in our cool. Then. Okay. Let's give away something else, and then I'll tell you all a little story in between. So let's see. How about let's do – I know. It's pretty good. How about the Miranda leopard jacket and the pink hat? And a pair of socks. And a pair of socks. You got it. So, <clears throat> here we go. So this is, you guys will recognize this. This has been in a bajillion Miranda videos. I have two of these, so I switch off between the two. Um, this one was used on the set of Haters Back you Off. You've had that for so long. I know. This one was used on the set of Haters Back Off, though. So this was a Haters Back Off costume. And I don't remember when I wore it on Haters Back Off or... If I wore this in a senior You did because look, there's a red thing on yeah, it to mark that mark it was it yours. Well. And they yeah. took off the label. Mm -hmm. You're in uh, one of the music videos? I don't remember. But yeah. I've worn it in a lot of Miranda videos. Like this is pretty iconic Miranda, and I still have one. I have one left. So when I give this away, you will be matching Miranda. And uh, this pink hat, which has been used in my live show, in the Michael Jackson part of the show. And it has been used in a lot of Miranda videos. I can't believe you're giving those away. It's for a good cause. That's crazy. Right 
Well, yeah, but like genie in the bottle and hair stuff off. You're wearing matching. Genie in the bottle. No, I was wearing a poofy jacket. I didn't have this one yet. I, I know it's not on that one, but I, I think it's somewhere. Um, but it's in millions of YouTube Miranda videos. Yeah. Someone just said in the comments, does everyone win a prize? Yes, because you win the prize of helping a child with cancer if you don't, ah! which is better than winning stuff. So you do win a prize. Mm -hmm. Um, whether you, if you donate and you win a physical thing, you are helping people, I promise. And to let people know, like a lot of times when you, people do fundraising charities, they take like a cut of their profits because like this is work to them. Colleen doesn't take any money. I donate no, my own to her own. I donate. She donates, she matches it mostly. So like. Well, don't say that this time. <laughs> Cause you guys have already raised 26,000. She also pays for the shipping. She doesn't even like. You Whoa. Guys, what? Oh, so every year, basically what I try to do is um, the first year I matched it because I think we raised $20,000 that first year. So the first year I matched it. Um, we're at 32000 hey. hey. So the first year I matched it and then every year after that I found I, I would pay like 10000 of my own or 15000 of my own either to an organization or to I find a specific family who needs it. So this year I'm, what I want to do is find a family to give money to directly, um, and then maybe some of my own money to an organization too, because there's a lot of awesome organizations that help. So, um, I yeah, I don't take any money. I would never take money away from kids with cancer. That's really horrible. Who does that? <laughs> a lot of people. Um, okay, so here's these things. Let's see who we're going to give away to now. I'm gonna read French. I should pick someone from the GoFundMe too. Because I started to GoFundMe first and people were donating there. And then I had to switch it to Fundly for reasons we won't talk about because it's been, it's been a struggle. Um, and so, uh, but people were already donating. So I'll find someone who donated there. Let's see. Oh, I hate this part so much. I hate this part right here. Um, oh, you guys, I hate this part so much. It is so hard for me to. I don't want to say anybody's name right now because I don't want to freak them out. Say so thinking they're going to win a prize. Yeah. Maybe later you should give them shout outs, like read what they say. Oh yeah, for sure. Um, here, I know what we can do in the meantime though. While I'm looking for someone to give this to, um, Mom, mm -hmm. you want to come? Or Rachel's eyes are better. Actually, no offense, but <laughs> none, none take. I love you so much. But it's reading small print. So oh, this is. That. I'm going to tell you guys what. Just okay. So we donate some money to a company called uh, Family, family Reach. Reach every single year. It's an awesome company that gives money to the families. Um, so like they can pay not for medical bills, not for hosp hospital bills, but they pay for their rent. They pay for their car. They pay for stuff like that. So this is just in the last couple of years. What our fundraising has done um, overall, like, can you read just that? Yeah, your fundraising efforts and the generosity of your network allowed for 118 individuals to remain in their home, 43 individuals to keep the heat, hot water, and lights on, and 39 individuals to maintain as sorry maintain access to critical cancer care by ensuring their vehicle remains on the road. So you helped with mortgages, utilities, and cars. Which is awesome. And other. But those and are like, other. Those yeah, are but those are like, like the bigger ones that they wanted to mention. Yeah. So families didn't have to get kicked out of their homes or lose their cars or not have lights on or hot running water in their houses while getting treatment for cancer. Because sometimes a parent has to give up their job. Yeah. A parent, like, yeah, your kids, kid, kid you're not going to go drop the kid off the no. hospital and then go to work. You, you, mm. lots of parents, usually someone has to quit their job. And a lot of the funds go to, helping their kid fight cancer so they don't have money for anything else like what are you gonna do choose between hot water or your kid you know fighting you're gonna choose your kid yeah let's do that because it's like showing me the same message well, it's just the end, so. yeah is everyone can everyone get off the internet on their phones maybe that will help yeah i'll yeah. turn off my computer because our internet is going real slow right now oh. i can't maybe i can up download on my phone <laughs> Don't restart it. <laughs> I'm <gonna> cry. <laughs> um, let's see. I'll check on. Um, he's yeah. in here. 
My parents are literally running around an island trying to find each other. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I'm going to find someone on Twitter because the site's being kind of a bummer. So if you donated, show me on Twitter. Oh, the wo the website is under heavy load. <laughs> Stop breaking the internet. Just break the internet. Colleen! Heavy load. It's a heavy load, man. <laughs> <laughs> that is the worst phrase in the world. <laughs> um, have you guys done lunch? We yeah. just had a sandwiches. All right. Sorry. We might have but vegan things. Point. Here's all these people. So if you want okay. To, um, you do your Twitter. I'll do Twitter for this one and then. Okay, how about this girl? So we'll message her on Twitter. Yeah. Katie X Ballinger. She has a profile picture of Rachel. So we stand. She said, I spent the last of my pocket money to donate and it makes me feel so good. It made me feel so good after. Love you loads and hope I can win a prize. Let's beat cancer's butt. That is awesome. So Katie X Ballinger, Corey will be messaging you and you won these things. <laughs> Yay! I did Yay! It. You picked someone. It only took 10 minutes. This, we'll live stream is gonna be, hours. this live stream is going to be literally 12 well, hours long. I'm like, like, so gonna be like, oh, two hours maybe Matt. So I was like, <laughs> no. Hopefully it's not gonna be longer than that. But I'm just I just it's so hard for me to pick because I want everyone to win something and it's like everyone's it's so hard. Like I want everyone to feel like scrolling point. Okay, so I'm gonna tell you some of the people at Family Reach that you guys have helped. Um so you guys can understand like the actual like the impact that you have. So um a little boy named Caleb he has leukemia. He's one year old, and you guys helped their family with mortgage. So you paid the fam for the family's house so that they could live in their house while he was going through leukemia. A one year old little boy. Like, can you imagine? I am a mom, and I'm really pregnant right now. Like, imagining that is <laughs> sorry. I'm gonna be way more emotional this year than normal because that is awful. That's awful. Like, that's not fair. So, um, you guys, but you guys helped their family. That's so cool. Uh, let's see. Sorry, really pregnant. Um, like literally could go into labor during this live stream. Um, okay. Let's see. Alexander is three years old. Um, he has hepatoblastoma from Oklahoma. And um, you guys gave him $1,500, $1,500 for transportation. So that could have been towards car payments, could have been for a new used car. It could have been for, you know, anything it just is transportation but i'm assuming that would be for some sort of a car to get to and from the hospital emma who i've met and is a total sweetheart we helped pay their family's mortgage and i got to meet her and her mom and it was an amazing experience um i'm going to read what her mom said i just want to start by thanking you for what you and your organization organization does for families like ours. She's talking about Family Reach, which is one of the companies I donate to. It has been an adjustment trying to get back on our feet as Emma's treatment winds down, fundraising donations stop, and my husband and I try to regain the work hours we used to work. Um, the assistance from Family Reach and the amazing donor, donors who joined Clean Boundaries Crusade gave us relief when I was feeling mounting financial stress. Our family was three months behind on our mortgage with no solution in sight. You will never truly know what you did for Emma and our entire family. So, um, Emma was 11 years old and she had dreams of perfecting her backflips. She just completed her first season of cheerleading um, and she started having trouble with her flips and they found out that she had a lump in her arm and after an x-ray they found out it was cancer and they took her for treatment and um, so basically this it goes on and on and on and on. Um, uh, it makes us feel like we were taking time bomb. When Emma heard about what Miranda and her fans did for our family, she cried tears of joy. That is the first time I can remember Emma crying tears of happiness. Ooh, <laughs> sorry, really pregnant. But that's because of you guys. So like, you can see that like, this makes a difference, whether it's a dollar or $10, like for a mom to say that she saw her daughter cry tears of joy for the first time in a long time because of you guys and what you did and you helped their family not lose their home. Like it's making a difference. Um, so please keep donating and spreading the word. And the family Reach also said that one in three families that you know are struggling, that have a child struggling with cancer, 
goes through financial distress, emotional distress. That's one in three. So every three families that have cancer, one of them is struggling and needs help. Mm -hmm. So for $10 for you could be a couple Starbucks, but it could make a difference in changing, you know, the lives of these kids with cancer and their families. So it's really, really important that we all um, donate and help in any way that we can. So for the next person, I'm going to pick from Twitter again, and I'm going to pick someone who's just being a crusader and spreading the word and raising awareness. So you could have donated, maybe you did, maybe you didn't, but people who are on Twitter spreading the word about the fundraiser and the live stream, um, and you know, letting people know about this, that's who I'm going to pick next. Cause I think that's important too. And I want to show you guys, you don't have to donate money to help. You can donate by spreading the word and um, spreading awareness. You also need to pick a prize first yes. though, sweetie. I know, I know. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, so let's see, let's Lots do clothes. Yeah, spread happiness shirt. Happiness sweatshirts. Maybe uh, another one of like a Miranda, the purple Miranda shirt. And um, the socks, of course. <laughs> oh my God, these socks. They're just like. And the, I think there's another sh shirt over there, like a mood shirt. Yes. And a book. Oh my God. There's a lot of stuff. Oh, there's so much. There's a lot of stuff we're giving away. So okay. So we've got my diary, which I'll sign. This shirt that says moods, and all of Miranda's moods are the same. And we have a Miranda cat sweatshirt, iconic. Um, these all have cat hair on them. You're welcome. A spread happiness shirt and hello. <laughs> so, <laughs> the entire world isn't wearing these socks next week. These socks next week. I want ass. pictures of you win these. I want pictures of you in them. Um, okay, let's see. I've never seen these before in my life. I know because no one wanted them. <laughs> no, I'm not. Those that don't even look like anything. Um, ballets. Um, oh, I hate this part. I hate it. I need help. Just scroll and point. No, it's too hard. Cause like, <laughs> oh my gosh. I retweeted just saying. Thank you, Rachel. Um, <laughs> I'm very stressed. 40 grand. 40 grand? 40 grand? Mm -hmm. Ooh, oh my God. God. You guys are amazing. I wish we had best. confetti. Please. I know. I'm sure we do somewhere in this house. I'm just not going to go find it. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. I feel like we need to be telling stories while I'm doing this part. Okay. Like, <laughs> that's the part where we need to um, We need to fill the side. Those veggie crisps are good. I want to try one. You won't like them. Uh, I'll read the one about Gabriel. Gabriel's father is a U.S. citizen and currently working on an application for permanent permanent residency for Gabriel and his mother. With the green card, Gabriel could be able to access New York Medicaid, a more comprehensive health insurance benefit. And then the numerous fees associated with this application, coupled with the cost association with Gabriel's medical treatment, are crazy for this family. And so with your help, Family Reach Grant covered the application fees for the U.S. Department of Homeland Security for Gabriel to receive permanent citizenship here in the United States so that he can access his care that he needs. When he learned of the grant made possible by the donations from Miranda Singh's followers, Gabriel's father, Jose, simply stated, I really thank everyone and can express how much I appreciate the grant we received. It really was a miracle. That's amazing. I read that one and cried when I read it earlier. They all make me cry because I'm pregnant. <laughs> um, that one was from a couple of years ago, too. Um, so over the years, we really helped a lot of families. Okay, so I'm going to do, I just screenshotted it. Let's give this to Wengi. No, Wengi? I never know how to, Wengi. I never know Wengi? how to pronounce her name. Dodie Colleen. D-O-D-I-E, Colleen. She said, donate. Ah, I'm not able to donate because I don't have enough to. I feel so, so bad. I'm trying to spread the word as much as I can. And I'm visiting my local hospital with my friends to hang out with the kids for the holiday season. And I think that's awesome. And that's exactly what I'm looking for um, from you guys. So please do that. Go visit your local hospital. It's really easy to do. And um, 
send me pictures if you do it. I want to see that, like, you know, how you're helping. And uh, and it also shows all your followers that they can do it too. And it's easy and it's fun. Uh, that's what I was surprised about. Anyone who might be nervous about, like, donating time to a hospital, you might think, like, oh, it's going to be so sad. Like, we're going to, like, see all these sick kids. And it's it's not like that. It's really, like wonderful and it's fun because you don't they don't want to talk about the, how they're sick they want to have fun so you're not there to talk about how they're sick and cry and be sad it's like a fun atmosphere the nurses are fun the kids are having a blast like right like it's like we play yeah. music and paint it and tell there stories there was one boy that was obsessed with superheroes mm -hmm. and so like even the nurses that came in to see him they were a special superhero so that's what he would call them the they nurse, don't have superhero like, powers captain electricity or whatever so like every person that came in to his little room like was a superhero so i thought it was cute because he had um he wasn't no one could come into his room without being covered up because of what he had and so like we they you, you couldn't spread anything there was no germs so you had to be fully covered like gloves mask everything so instead of being like you know sad that everyone had to be completely covered up just to be in the same room as him he in his mind he was like they're all superheroes and it was like such a cool fun experience it was awesome so it's not scary to donate time to kids who are sick it's fun and it's helpful and they're sitting in a room all day like by themselves like they're just having someone to come by and say hi to them for a little bit you know it means the world yeah okay so now um let's pick something else let's do the little green baggie is it by bath and beyond and it goes with that candle or bath and body i would think those two next stuff. me too um, let's do those two. So this we got at Bath and Body Works and it's a little candle. It's my favorite candle, which is Fresh Balsam, which is a weird name, but it smells like Christmas trees. And this cute little clutch, which I think is adorable. I love her. And, um, inside it has, um, oh, the lid came off. Uh, vanilla bean fragrance mist and vanilla bean shower gel and vanilla bean body lotion I smell this. and vanilla bean body cream. I'm pretty sure this is what Todrick wears. Yes. If anybody is a fan yeah. of Todrick, he buys this. He smells bowl. like this. Like this is exactly oh, this what Todrick Hall smells like. This is Todrick Hall. Todrick Hall smells, smells just like this. If and you he walk is, in his bathroom, he literally has 20 bottles. And of he it. smells like that all the time, like 24 seven, that, that just smelling that. And I was like, Oh, Todrick's in the room. Okay. So these are what we're giving away right now. I'm going to pick from, the fundraiser website on Fundly. So go donate. And um, I'm looking at what you guys are saying over there. Oh, I'm out of breath. My kid is hogging my lungs. <sighs> are you going to labor? I will. Am I going to labor, guys? Live stream. Push. No, he's up high. You can see, like, look how high he is. He should not be this. If I'm going to labor, he's not going to be pressed up against my boobs. He needs to drop. A little low. <laughs> um, alrighty. So this person. Um, oh, oh, I want to help you. I want to do it all. I hate this part. <laughs> you, this is your fourth thing. How about Christina Ann? <gasps> Christina. She said, I'm a college student with little money, but this fundraiser means so much to me because my grandma died of cancer. I love to help out. So Christina, you won the candle and the clutch with all the stuff. And socks. <laughs> I'm sitting at one of those socks. Um, thank you so much for donating. And um, I hope that you enjoy. Uh, what was I going to say? Oh, um, wait, now I don't remember. <laughs> College student. Oh, you said grandma. your grandma passed away of cancer. My grandma passed away of cancer, too. Um, cancer is brutal and horrible, disgusting, and I hate it. And hopefully this all will help. So I donate money to the families through Family Reach to help specific families, which are the ones we're talking about. But I also donate a big chunk of money. One year I did to St. Jude's. This year I'm doing to the Children's Hospital of Los Angeles so that we can also help find a cure. So we're helping families with their bills and then we're also helping hospitals who are you know, helping these kids and hopefully finding a cure for this and so that we don't have to do fundraisers anymore because there will be a cure for cancer. That would be awesome. And Corey's got, gotten close to a lot of kids that have been struggling with cancer and they've told us in the past that the treatments 
a lot of them are prehistoric. Like they haven't been updated updated at all. So like the treatment that they did in the 80s is still being used today. And that's just crazy. Yeah, like there's not new medicines. Like there's some kids with cancer who are being treated, like you said, for, with treatments from the 80s, the 70s. And they just haven't updated the treatments because there's no money and they're not. Time or whatever. Yeah, so um, that's crazy to me. That like, can you imagine going in for like, anything like strep throat and then being like um there's not really a cure for your cough your strep throat but we have this medicine from 1973 might work <laughs> like i mean you would be like no but there's no they don't have a choice there's no option um okay let's do the jojo siwa backpack and some socks naturally um so this backpack is a doozy. Jojo Siwa is a good friend of our family. She's like family to us. And I went to her house and she filled this back, filled this backpack. I'll pick this person from Twitter. So start tweeting your donation information, um, showing me what you've donated. So in here we have, mom, you're gonna be in charge of putting this all back in. So I'm gonna hand you. <laughs> Bath bombs, Bobo. Yeah. We have a tiny little backpack full of chapsticks. This is oh my really God, cute. That's super cute. <laughs> a JoJo microphone. Oh! Awesome. That was awesome! Okay. <laughs> that was JoJo awesome. screaming. That was awesome. Uh -oh. oh, that's my favorite! Hold the drama. Um, okay. BU jewelry. So this is like charms and a necklace. Yeah. Heart bows on the I back. Love I love it. her heart bows. JoJo and Bobo take the stage. A book. I haven't read that. Either. I haven't read that one either. A fluffy pencil. That's yes, clueless. JoJo's Guide to the Sweet Life. This is an epic book. A hairbrush. And it's squishy. You can feel it. <laughs> headphones, which, by the way, this isn't the one that I have, but I do have JoJo headphones, and I use them all the time. She does. Like, and I literally do use By them. the way, JoJo and I go to the same gym. JoJo wears these at the gym. <laughs> yeah, she I'm does. not joking. A bedazzled JoJo watch. Whoa. This is wow. a really killer prize. Yes. I want this. JoJo sunglasses. This would not fit my face. Look at this bow. Wow. She let me pick up the bows, and I That's picked up my favorites. So of course they all sparkle because me. Oh my gosh, need this in my life. <laughs> I kind of want to for myself. And a Christmas bow. Oh, How cute is that? Oh, that was cute. These are authentic JoJo bows. Ooh, and crazy foam fun foam body wash shampoo and conditioner to oh, one it goes everywhere i see a new rachel video testing jojo products coming out in the shower where she tries this body wash shampoo yeah, and that's what I, gotta do. Do. I gotta go to jojo's later okay <laughs> i have to get in on that one because it was my idea but whatever okay and this i am the queen of jojo and, products. Oh, and, and so, lest we forget the <laughs> Okay, so I'm gonna check Twitter now. Testing JoJo bath products. Yeah, bath bombs. Yeah, she's got bath bombs. Mm -hmm. She's got. Okay, I'm texting her. Ugh, that was my idea. I'm just saying. You said, hey, you should do. So if she has a bath, we doing. can do a collab and we can both. Have you started, I'll use your bathtub. Have yeah, you started I hate my bathtub. Bath. Twelve days of socks. Not yet. It doesn't start yet. Oh, so okay. there's twelve days. <laughs> okay. We have twelve days of JoJo socks. Um. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. I need to find someone for these this JoJo backpack. This is pretty epic. I want a JoJo thing. <laughs> um. Oh man, my nose itches. Um. I'm, this is literally so hard to pick. I really hate this part. Um. Okay. I feel like she has to win because of this. <laughs> Yeah. Let's see here. I don't know. This is this is hard because oh she's cute. Uh, I saw myself, so she wins. Okay, I think let me just make sure. Oh yeah, she's spreading the word. She's doing good. Okay, so Sarah, <clears throat> happy Ballinger. Here it's H A P P Y Y. Oh, that's sneaky, sneaky. P P Y Y Ballinger. She said, I'm so incredibly happy I could finally donate this year. Thank you so much for using your platform for things like this. It's so important. It is inspiring and warms my heart that I could be a part of it. Helping these kids is the biggest prize I could win. And she donated $15. 
And she sent me a picture of her in JoJo merch, <laughs> wearing a JoJo bow and a JoJo shirt. So now you're going to have a lot more JoJo merch. Oh, we better get an updated picture. That's yeah, I want a picture of you wearing all that stuff. And the socks. Okay, Sarah. Um, yeah, and the socks. Don't forget my socks. By the way, the socks are like shockingly small as well. Like the foot part is really? like that bit. They never fit my feet. They won't. I don't know. I haven't tried them on. We should all try them on for the video. Oh, That's what yes. we do. Um, okay, so next, let's do let's do some haters back off stuff. JoJo's on board with our video. Um, okay, so let's do some red pants and the scrubs. The scrubs right there, and then one of Emily's paintings, maybe. Well, there's a lot of stuff to go through. We have a lot of stuff to give away. Who's paintings? Emily. Ran a sister. Oh I was like, who in the world is Emily? <laughs> so here we have. Wait, and the socks. And the socks. <laughs> <laughs> so we have red sweatpants. So on set of Haters Back Off, season one and two, which is the Netflix show that um, I was on and he was on and I wrote. Um, Dad and I and Corey were all on it. That's true. <laughs> There's a lot of Haters Back Off stars in the room right now. Um, there was a lot of different versions of the red sweatpants because we couldn't use the kind with the haters back off on the butt because the story of haters back off is Miranda pre her getting famous. So, um, and then right when she gets famous. So she didn't have the haters back off butt pants yet. Um, and so we had a bunch of different versions of red sweatpants that Miranda wears. And this is one of them. It's a very thick one. And on hot days, these were not fun to wear. Um, because we have another kind that was much looser that I also have for this is one of Emily's paintings. Miranda's sister um, is a painter on the show. And um, she did a gallery art show in season two. And we had a ton of paintings of hers. And this is one of her paintings. Um, the actress, Francesca Reale, did not paint this. We had what? set deck people paint. So there's we had a painter that we hired who, I mean, he painted hundreds of paintings like this. Um, so that was on the show. And this is iconic. This is um, a hospital gown that <laughs> Eric is sporting right now. And it is from episode four of season two of Haters Back Off. And it's when Miranda is in the hospital with her mom. Her mom's in the hospital and she gives her kidney to her mother. But she decides to do a fashion show first because she wants to do sell merch at the hospital. And she puts her face on everything. So I put my face on well, these scrubs. Well, Patrick, yeah, Patrick does it. So um, that is what this is. And, and the socks. And the socks. <laughs> this one's going to be hard to pick <laughs> because these are really special to me and it's really, really hard to part with them um, because they're from my show and my show is my baby. You know, before this baby, he's my second child. He just off with my first child. What about cats, man? And they're cats. Um, so if you want to win that stuff, donate. And let me know uh, that you donated, I guess. Are you doing Twitter or Fundly or GoFundMe? <laughs> I'm doing Twitter right now. Okay. Feels less stressful on Twitter. I tooted. Stress toots. Okay. I don't know. This is really hard. Because <laughs> I want to pick everyone. Uh, hmm. Someone tell a story. Okay. Well, what? Oh, I'll of course not. <laughs> um, there's a 17 year old boy, Gordon, and he's like an enormously caring young man who was diagnosed with leukemia in September 2014. He lives in Alabama with his parents. Gordon was critically ill when his symptoms first appeared. He was rushed from the emergency room near his home in Alabama to numerous children's hospitals in Florida, where he was finally diagnosed with cancer. After completing an initial three months of aggressive chemotherapy while inpatient, Gordon and his parents traveled to Florida weekly for the outpatient treatment. They maintained this grueling schedule for 18 months. Unfortunately, Gordon's cancer stopped responding to chemotherapy. His treatment team made the recommendation that Gordon transfer his care to the Anderson Children's Hospital in Texas and undergo a bone marrow transplant. Thankfully, his sister was a perfect match to act as his bone marrow right. transplant wow. donor. Because the Ronald McDonald house was full, Gordon's mom, Christy, paid a significant amount of money out of pocket for the family's extended stay near the Anderson Hospital during the three months of his treatment. Gordon's dad works normally, oh, 
Gordon's dad normally works construction, but is no longer working while serving as a primary caregiver, staying at Gordon's bedside. Christy is continuing to work as a town administrator for the family's small town in Alabama. Fortunately, she has some flexibility to work to work remotely and travel back and forth to Texas every two weeks. Wow, she's Louise. Uh, and then it says, fortunately, Christy learned about family reach by another family reach um, grant recipient at the hospital. The plan. The family social worker contacted Family Reach, and a grant was quickly made to cover the lodging expenses for the next three months they will remain with Gordon in Texas. Wow. So, <sighs> donate. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I picked someone. Um, Mary Millie at Jessica, S T E A underscore. I'll screenshot it too in case. S T A underscore. Mm -hmm. Okay. okay. Let me, oh, oh, sorry. I wanted to see it. She's wearing oh. random merch right now. Oh, Jessica's T. She donated $10. Jessica's T. And so you win that stuff from Haters Back Off. Congratulations, Millie. Okay, so next let's do um, the blessed cheese balls. Cheese balls with the red sweatpants. And one of the Emily drawings. What seed is the blessed? That is from, you don't know? One, well, I mean, no. The grocery store, <laughs> season two, episode course, six. Yeah. Uh, at the grocery store. <laughs> what? The fact that you just know that. That's I insane. know everything yeah, right. about him. I wrote the stuff. show. I know. I do a lot of things. I don't know what I did. Is that cheese so, balls and stuff? This is the actual one I wore in the scene. Yeah. Is this hard for you to see that I'm giving this away? I can't believe you're giving it away. Yeah. It's for a good cause. It's for a great cause. Do you want to wear it? <laughs> um, so I have a I have another one of these that's clean because we had two versions of this shirt on set. Actually, we had three because our um, my stunt double did it, um, wore it too. So Oh, yeah. I have so basically there's a so scene you where you put that hair straight on. No, I was I trying like, to reach. I picked the design. <laughs> yes, Corey picked out the design of the shirt, and we picked out like the buttons and everything. And so we designed. Corey pretty much designed this shirt, and um, the cost our amazing customer season two made it for us. And um, so I in this scene am being a hot mess as Miranda, and I'm on top of like. This what do you call this? Like checkout stand pole. No. You know and the pole the has a light and then the number the check stand. Mm -hmm. yeah, the number pole. And so I'm on it and it's wobbly and then I fall into cheese popcorn and I get covered mm. in cheese popcorn and this is like what's left of it like after it's been washed. It was I was I was covered like and it wasn't from falling in it. They literally rubbed it all over me, all over my pants, my face. It was in my hair. They rubbed cheese popcorn. They didn't use like sometimes on TV shows. They're like, oh, we have this like dust that we made that's vegan, organic, whatever. No, they were literally rubbing cheese popcorn in my <laughs> hair and on my face, like literally picking up cheese popcorn off the ground and rubbing it on my face. Um, so that's what's all of this is actual cheese popcorn. And I have a funny picture of my. Uh, director's chair. This is Colleen Ballinger, the like chairs that you the actors sit in, just orange because yeah. it was <laughs> all over me. And then these are the red sweatpants um, that I wore in the show and Uncle Jim wore. And then I, we have a few pair of these. So the family pants. These are the family Damn. pants. So Uncle Jim wore these in the season one, episode four. And um, it's the first time Miranda ever wears the sweatpants. Um, she is wearing a skirt and she doesn't want to go on stage because people will see up her skirt. So her uncle gives her his pants to wear. And that's what these are. So these are from a Netflix original series. And this, this is a good prize. Oh my gosh. This is a drawing of Miranda that Miranda's sister did in season two, episode. Oh, come on. I think it's episode five. Episode five. The end of episode five. Um, she gives her this. Is that right? Yeah, it is. Because she's upset about Patrick, and that's the Patrick episode. And she tapes it to her wall. She tacks it on her wall. And it's the first drawing that is ever on Miranda's fan art wall was her sister's drawing. And we have a bunch of these. So the artist who drew this had to draw a million because I would tack on the wall and put a hole in it. And so they need a fresh one for every single take. So we had a bunch of these. So I'm giving one of these away. But they're all hand-drawn. It's not a photocopy. That's real. And the socks. So luckily, when I was looking for someone in the last 
round. I picked two people, so I wouldn't have to go. So the this person who's going to win this is Abby. Hello, CMB. Okay. Abby Lee Miller. Um, and she said, holy moly, Emily is my favorite. I'm obsessed with her paintings. I've seen haters back off so many times. I was Miranda and my best friend as Patrick for Halloween. Look this picture. Oh, cute. Isn't that great? It's great. Yeah. So Abby, hello. I love you, Abby. Enjoy. I picked that one fast. So maybe it's good if I pick them. Yeah. More yeah. than one at a time. You should do something from a Fondly or GoFundMe. Yeah, I'll do, next I'll do Fondly. Oh my gosh, how much are we at? 47. 47? Yes, you can see. Whoa. Whoa! Wait, it's yes. refreshing. Okay, let's Refresh. do the Polaroid camera. Refresh. 47. And a book and thoughts. Shake it like a Polaroid picture. $47,000. Is that supposed to be skin tone? I don't know what it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be white socks. White socks under With Crocs and, and then the, the pants. Okay. So we have my diary. We have Look at that. a Polaroid Ooh. camera. Not from Haters Back Off. No. And film, because you always need extra film. One is colorful, and this is just regular. And the best part of this, the socks. Don't deal. So I'm going to pick from Funly this time around. Um, well, I'm picking from Funly every time, essentially. But this time, I am going to look at the little messages. Go to your page. Oh, go to my page. Don't know how anything works. 48. 48. Yay. Um, let's see. Oh, we should pick one of these. Oh, sorry. I shouldn't say you don't see it. Let's do Allison Payne donated $270. Wow. Thank you, Allison. I'm going to pour up so you can message. Yeah, I'm going to click the name. So you want this cool stuff. Look, I'm getting faster. I'm also getting a little faint. <laughs> oh, lay down. <laughs> Do you need something? No, I just need to drink more water. I think it's like I'm excited and like nervous and anxious. I'm ready to catch The you. emotions are like running through your body. And my baby's big. I just need to like lean forward so he's not leaning against the arteries on my back and clogging my blood flow to my brain. What was that price? Normal thing. The Polaroid. Polaroid. I'm also writing it down, too, Corey. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, it's written down. Down. yeah we, nice. we're making sure we've got it all written down. Okay. Okay, so um, how about I talk about really quickly the girls on the, the if you go to the Funly, everyone go to the Funly page, you'll see a picture of me and the cutest little girl ever, Natalie, and then if you scroll, you'll see a picture of me and the other cutest little girl, Kayla. So these are two girls through doing this. I have met so many amazing kids with cancer, and those are two girls that have impacted me greatly. Um... Natalie is a sweetheart who came to my show, came backstage with a friend, Camille, who's actually the person who told me all about Family Reach and got me inspired to do these fundraisers every year. And uh, she introduced me to Natalie. And Natalie, I would, um, I stayed in touch with her. I'd send her stuff to the hospital. And um, I would talk to her all the time, see how she was doing. Unfortunately, cancer was a total jerk and took Natalie. Um, so she's a little angel now for us. And blah, 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 blah. <laughs> and Kayla is the other girl of uh, the two girls that I posted pictures of. I met Kayla last year on my birthday. <laughs> Sorry. And uh, Kayla passed away too from cancer. And I still stay in touch with Kayla's mom. She's the sweetest woman in the world. I'm obsessed with her. She's wonderful. And her family's awesome. Um, but Kayla, I was supposed to go into Kayla's room at the hospital on my birthday and hang out with her for like 10 minutes, half an hour, you know, just like chat and get to know her. And I ended up being in her room for two hours because she was so awesome. And we had so much in common. And her family was so cool. And um, she's just amazing. And I ended up staying really close with her mom. Um, and... Uh, 
but cancer made her a beautiful little angel too. Um, so those are two, just two of the girls that I have met through all of this who've impacted me greatly. And your money helps their families, um, helps families like their families, helps kids like them who are amazing, sweet, wonderful girls. Um, actually, can you hand me the picture frame over there? The white picture frame? It's underneath my jacket. No, 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 it's like, on. yeah, yeah. So Kayla um, was super cool and Kayla was a photographer and her mom actually gave me this. It's one of the pictures she took and framed it and gave it to me for my birthday um, with a picture of Kayla on the back. Kayla loves photography. Um, she was super awesome. I, she was amazing and is amazing. Um, but you know, That's gorgeous. yeah, she's a really good photographer. Um, so, uh, kids like this need your help because we can't keep losing kids to cancer. It's not fair. <laughs> so, um, that's why all this money really, really helps. Um, it helps their families. It helps us find a cure. It helps the hospitals. Um, and so it's really, really important that you guys donate your money and your time, uh, People are saying, please don't cry. It's important to feel emotions over things that are sad. So it's okay that I'm crying. I'm happy right now that you guys are helping. Kayla and Natalie would be so excited and happy that you guys are donating to help other kids. Sorry. I'm so pregnant. <laughs> <That's not your> <laughs> um, so that's who those girls are on the fundraiser page um so I, I get to meet a lot of really cool kids through this and um those are just two of the awesome girls that i've met and unfortunately we've lost them to cancer which is not fair so let's raise more money and help other kids just like them and help their families so that they can keep paying for the medicine that they need so that we can beat cancer um and you know lose if help lose not left <sighs> Not lose, not lose anymore or lose even if it helps us to not lose one more person um it's worth it like so okay sorry very emotional can't breathe can't talk stress you want to give something away yes okay <laughs> oh, sorry <laughs> oh we have fifty thousand yeah! dollars yeah! 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 um let's do rachel's and the socks and the socks this does not go with my merch bundle <laughs> Socks go with every merch. Can you please ship it with the Ziploc bag? Yes. Okay. So this is Rachel's baggie. Take it out and explain, and I'll find a winner. Okay. So you have this that I have too many of at my house. You have the book that I wrote, 101 Things That Piss Me Off. Still mostly relevant to my life today. And then uh, one of my merch shirts, it's a size medium. It says Ballinger on the front, and then 91 Ballinger on the back. 91 is my birth year. So that's all I had. I was gonna get a post or two, but um, I didn't wanna get a box that was under something out. So that's what that is. That's my contribution. So Thank you, Rachel. if you really wanna win this. And then also the socks. I'm putting that in the bag. Don't say that. also, you mean, and most importantly. Bonus. <laughs> Just, I, 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 I get socks, right? Here, mom. How about this girl? <clears throat> um, Katie Issa Slugari. Oh, I'll screenshot it. So. Let me see it. Um, she said, just a few days ago, I cut 10 inches of my hair to donate to women and girls with cancer. I think wow. what you're doing is so important. I hope my donation can help a kid. So, and then she helped spread the word about my, um, go find my awesome. family. So um, that's amazing. That's another way. That's another free way you can donate um, to people with cancer is by chopping off your hair and giving it to. I've done that. Yeah. Um, so Katie, you won the Rachel bundle, but most importantly, the, the socks. socks. Um, let's do the. I have a prize too. Oh, yay. Get it. Get what it. is it? Run, Corey, run. Well, he's running. Let's do the. You're not so um, fast. Let's do the the purple hangy dangly and the blue hangy dangly. Okay, what are they? Because I'm, I'm not going to write down purple hangy dangly. Actually, the purple hangy dangly. And oh my goodness! Wait, oh Corey, you got some beat solos. What? Why do you have these? 
I am impressed. Um, okay. We're doing Hi. this instead. This is good. So who wants to win these mamma jammas and also some socks? <laughs> <laughs> Most importantly. <laughs> Most importantly, who wants the socks? I'm going to go back to funly.com and pick a winner. This is a good prize. Corey DeSoto for the win. 51000 I don't remember how much we raised exactly last year, but I think it was around It was a this. lot of money. Um, okay. Where's the, oh, your page. What? Oh, okay, oh. okay, okay. <laughs> Secrets. Um, let's see. Who do you think? You pick since it's yours. I didn't get to pick. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you can pick the next one. I want to. Let's do Jeffrey Smith. Jeffrey Smith. He donated $330. Thank you, Jeffrey. Um, you're amazing. You won my socks. Oh, so congrats. And, <laughs> and these. these. These are wireless. They're really good. Those are amazing. You don't need wires. Those are good headphones. I know. I'm like I kind know. of wanting to put this on my Christmas list. Like, sorry, JoJo. <laughs> this was over. I need okay. to sip out of a JoJo water bottle. I know. Literally. The socks are wireless. Yes. The socks are wireless. Yes, the too. socks are wireless. So we're going to do this and a book and socks. One dress, one book, one box. And Echo Dot. Echo Dot? Yeah. You know what an Echo Dot is? It's like Alexa. Oh, but so you, you have to have songs. Alexa already. What? Well, who has an Alexa? <laughs> you can't just use a dot? You can't I just don't think so. You can. No. Well, well, connects to, no, it says Echo Dot connects to Alexa. Yeah. Wow. So you have to have an Alexa. And then it's like you, you win really the prize. Big home. You win the prize of having to buy an Alexa. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, but the most important part is this, this used dress. This dress, though, is actually really special to me. So um, this it's is special to me, too. This is a big it's deal. It's a memory. This is Why? a memory from tour because I went on tour. I, start, I was starting to at rehearsals for tour. We left for tour the next day. And I got a call from my publicist saying, you're doing Ryan and Kelly tomorrow morning. Uh, and it yes. was like noon. And we were at rehearsal and I couldn't leave. And I was like, I don't have an outfit. I'm pregnant. Nothing fits me anymore. I didn't bring a, an outfit to wear on Ryan and Kelly uh, or Kelly and Ryan, live with Kelly and Ryan. And so we ran to the mall. We're like, like, it's fine. We'll just like pick Yeah, I was like, yeah, I'll be there. That's fine. And like, just said yes. Because I say yes to everything, even if I'm not prepared. And we ran to the mall. And were spazzes. Like, you and Johnny were running around the mall, like, going in every store, trying to find something. We couldn't find anything. Finally, we went to Charlotte Roos. And I love a Charlotte! This for, like, $20. No, but let me just tell you, we first were, like, the bougie stores mm -hmm. and, like, nothing. I no. tried on, like, I almost bought, like, a $400 Hundreds dress that was of dollars ugly. of dresses. Yes. They're so bad. And we ended up doing this number. $25. $25. And so many couples at Ryan Kelly, like, they loved it. Yeah, Ryan it. and Kelly were like, ooh, your outfit. So Everyone thought it was, like, designer. There's, like, strings hanging off of it. Like, <laughs> it's, like, literally garbage. Falling apart. <laughs> but it also was my first TV appearance. As a pregnant person. Hey -o. So like you can see my little bump in pictures of me wearing this on Kelly and Ryan. Um, I hugged Ryan Seacrest in this. So and has it been washed? Definitely not. <laughs> <laughs> Never. <laughs> None of the clothes she's giving away today have ever been washed. Maybe it has. <laughs> I can't smell anything, so I don't know. So this one is really special. That's to how me. you tell something. Because it was my my son's first TV appearance was in this. So I'm giving away really good. Are you sad? <laughs> I kept the Conan O'Brien one. I have that one. It was so funny to go Clint's like, where are we gonna find something? I am huge. I am so humongous. <laughs> I know. You literally can't even was tell. So Her I'm... stomach was like this big. I know, but you guys to too. No, yeah, totally. Me too. I was like, I know. We were like, oh my gosh, she's so big. How embarrassing. How are we, how are we gonna find anything that fits? I'm gonna look at. I'm gonna look up for the picture. So maybe I should print out that picture. And it's it's like literally small. Anyone can fit in it. So it's yeah. cute. I'm gonna find a picture of it. Um. So here's me walking on to Ryan and Kelly in this romper. You can't see my bump a little bit. It just looks like I ate a big lunch. You look so excited. I remember you thinking you looked so. Yeah. I thought I looked so big. Yeah. And now I look at this and I'm like, 
oh my God, I was so skinny. I was little. Um, so I will print out these pictures too so that, oh, Rachel, or Jessica just texted me and said, you can use the Echo Dot by itself. Thank you, Jessica, for watching. Um, Jessica, how? You science major. So you can use the Echo Dot. So this person, I want to. Machine? Oh, wait, she's like a theater major. <laughs> Let's see this picture. She's a major? What was she? Acting. She wasn't acting? Okay. I can't remember. I was like a child. How do I get this picture? Like, I was a literal child. What's the website? Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. save from I am a Oh, okay. Ten years younger. And then called it Eight years the picture later. of the website. Oh, I see, I see. Still not working. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Now we'll do it. Slide up. <gasps> save image. What? I never knew that's how iPhones work. You're living. Are you kidding me? You so, are mom. So that's what that means when you hold it and it does that thing. That little arrow, you start up, uh, yeah. Was my mom's currently trying to figure it out too. <laughs> Whatever, I'll screenshot it. Um, okay, so there you go. That's me in this, and then also me with Ryan and Kelly in this outfit. So you guys can be excited about that. And the book and the socks. And the socks <laughs> and the book. So here we go. Let's see. Um, they get Echo Dot too. Yeah, that's a good prize. Well, we have a lot of stuff to give away. Yeah. So, how's about? Are you doing Twitters? Um, I think so. How about Cabello's Colleen? She donated fifty dollars. Susanna, that's her name. Susanna one two one. I'm so happy to have been able to donate this year. Thank you for doing this. I truly admire how much. How you're making a difference in so many children's and families' lives. I would die for that. The Ryan and Kelly Rock Oh my God, love you always. So don't die, but you're getting it. <laughs> and the Echo Dot. And most importantly, the socks. There you go, Susanna. Let me start to make sure I get her oh, name Susanna. right. Oh, Susanna. Don't you cry for me. Thank you for being my brain. <laughs> <laughs> we are the same brain. I know. Okay, let's do, um, oh, this is hard decisions. Let's do the, the Miranda bird shirt and the uh, Miranda cat sweatshirt and the mood shirt and the spread happiness shirt. This is a big Miranda package, y'all. Uh, we're spread happiness shirt is not Miranda. Hey everyone, we're doing a live stream for Colleen's uh, childhood cancer. So go to Colleen's YouTube page and watch right now. Win some prizes. And socks. And socks. Most importantly, socks. Definitely the socks. So this prize is, let's make this a, a bigger. Okay, so, so we've got spread happiness. We've got okay. moods. We've got the sweatshirt. We've got, oh my gosh, the socks. And we've got this. That's a classic. It's a classic. It's been in so many Miranda videos, but now it is so stained with lipstick that it just is like, it's. Just, I think it's something else too. There's like Kool-Aid or um, something. You did like a, a video with some sort of thing and it got stained. Slime. Yeah. I don't know, but it's covered in slime stains, but it's been in a lot of videos. So I'm trying to think if there's anything else I want to add to this one. This is good. Um, all right, so I'm gonna go back to Funly and pick a winner for these things. Ooh, I'm feeling a real pain right now. You need anything? You want some iron? Um, I took my iron pill. Mm -hmm. You want some food? Some sugar. Eric, sugar. <laughs> Do we have ding dongs? Yeah, ding dongs. They're my ding dongs, but yes, you can have ding dongs. Yeah, they're in the pantry. Thanks, Corey. Thanks, Eric. You have cupcakes upstairs. Thanks, oh, I want that. You're welcome, Mom. Keep There's, that. Oh, sorry. Eric, she wants the cupcakes in her office. Well, that's where we keep cupcakes. That is where we keep cupcakes. <laughs> the hostess <laughs> cupcakes. There's a hostess cupcake box. Um, I feel like or there should be. Oh, oh and, the, and the blue hair spec. Well, no, actually, let's do, um, and the drawing of, uh, the drawing of Miranda. Sorry, let me just make a little bit. That's Emily's drawing? Emily drawing. And what else is over there? Um, There's a lot of stuff. I don't know, but it's like, I always feel bad when it's like merch. <laughs> um, let's do, I 
think they're fucking on that hood. Oh my gosh, Lacey just gave one thousand dollars. Lacey, does Lacey that get the bundle? Marie yes. Jones. Lacey, one thousand dollars to get the Miranda bundle. This is iconic, Lacey. What's I don't know Lacey's last name. I'm a terrible human. Maddox. Maddox. Thank you, Lacey. What's the bird shirt? It's from a million Miranda videos. I've been wearing it Miranda videos for literally like seven years. Um. Okay, we're we're hustling. How about let's do the record player? Oh, that's a good prize. So yeah, you, that's good. And socks. And socks. Well, and a Miranda sweatshirt. <laughs> she can't not. Yeah, and a cupcake. And no. the wrapper of this cupcake. <laughs> you Miranda. <laughs> okay. I actually have, oh, girl. Right. I have someone kind of pre picked because I, I was, I'm screenshotting things now, so it makes it go faster because I'm sorry, I'm going so slow. Let's do Aaron Dukes. Aaron Dukes on Twitter. He said, since the first year, I've donated every time. I'm glad to donate, but it would be amazing to win something. So every year he donates, he says. Oh, I know him. I met him at your show. Yeah, he's a sweetie. There uh, what go. did he win? He won oh, the record player. The record player. The hot sweatshirt and the socks. So congrats, Aaron. Thank you for donating. Like I said, I'm going to be writing letters to everyone. Wait, does he get the wrapper? Uh, sure. <laughs> Put it in a blocky bag because that's really gross. I'm sorry. It's gonna, <laughs> that's gross. Well, tweet me, Aaron, right now. I'm going to look at your Twitter. Tell me, do you want my trash? Do you want my wrapper? <laughs> Ew, yes. I'll see what he says. Aaron. Dukes. Wait, how does it spell? D U K E S S. There he is. He said, "I want the wrapper." Yep. Give him the wrapper. It's, it's packaged and on the wrapper. There we go. Next, let's do the makeup palette. The pink box. Ah. Oh. And um. This so is a good makeup palette. That is. I bought it for myself, and then last minute changed my mind, and I was like, I don't need any more makeup. I can give it away. It's um. um and let's do the mood shirt and some socks and the happiness shirt. What's the guy's name? Patrick Star. Patrick Star. Christmas. Hmm? Do you want one for Christmas? No, it's okay. <laughs> okay. This is actually a beautiful palette. There's actually and lipstick, lipstick in, in it. Go it. What? Yes, show it. You can rewrap that. I feel bad like unwrapping this stuff and giving away. I'm covered in chocolate right now. <laughs> a lip gloss. Cute. Um, I think. Mm hmm. Patrick start lipstick. Oh, packaging is everything. I know. It's living for it. So um, smart. It's like a nude. It's a nude lipstick coming from my brand with Daisy May. It's similar to the color of my lipstick. Um, and then this. Is almost dropped it and shattered it. Ooh, it's like a blush and bronzer duo. Cute packaging and the purple. Get out of here. So the reason I bought this for myself is because first of all, I love nude lipsticks, pinky nudes. But this is so pretty. Look at that palette, purples. And I'm not on the PR list. This was not free for me. I bought this. <laughs> <laughs> he does not send me his makeup. I bought this. Whenever I see YouTuber products in the stores, I buy them. Books, makeup, anything, like I always go to support. So um, bought this for me originally. And then I was like, wait, I don't need stuff. I'll give this to someone who donates. So this is going to someone who donates. And it also is coming with, hello. <laughs> Spread happiness shirt and the mood shirt. Um, this is a good little bundle and my hair's in it so you can clone me. Okay, I'm gonna go to my page. Oh, this internet is just garbage. It's, I love that I'm a YouTuber. It might just be the website that's busy, you know? Mm -hmm. Colleen has the worst internet on the planet. 20 mm -hmm. And the internet's her <laughs> business. Yeah, I'm gonna read, I'm gonna read through some of the comments on the Funly page. So if you donate right now, leave a comment because I'm gonna be reading the comments. 
So Savannah donated twenty dollars. She's not winning, Mama. Sorry, Savannah. I love you. But I'm just reading comments right now. Well, so, then don't say their names. Just read the comments. No, oh, I want to give a shout out. out. Okay. Oh, it's shout out time. Savannah donated twenty dollars, and she said, "Love you." Donating twenty potatoes, <laughs> and I think there's something wrong with this website because I've noticed a lot of the comments have question marks. Yeah. In the have you noticed that? Yes. I think like exclamation marks. exclamation marks but turn into question marks, marks on the website because a lot of people are saying like, they're asking so that I can donate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay. Regina Das. Colleen. What? I'm trying to read her name. Regine? Oh, is that what it is? <laughs> I'm bad at reading names. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Say what you call her. Regina. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, I just saw someone say, how do we donate? The link is below underneath in my Or oh, you should have enabled donations on this as well. I don't know how to do that. I'll show you. Well, I don't know where that goes. And I'm not going to YouTube. Much it takes. YouTube oh, you're right. YouTube might take some. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. I'm not letting YouTube take money from children with cancer. Um, okay. Uh, anyway, Regina said, Regini. Regini said, thank you for speaking on their behalf of Natalie and Kayla. I needed to hear that their voices will forever be heard because of you. And she gave $5. Thank you. Um, Natalie Posa said, many people I know have had cancer. I hope my $4 donation helps. It breaks my heart to see children with cancer. Oh. Um, Caitlin said she had $1 donation. This is my first year donating. I know it's not a lot, but I wanted to give anything I could. Oh, you guys are so sweet. $1 helps. Yeah, it does. Helps. Um, I can't make it load. Oh, here it goes. Guys. Um, Erica Nicole said, I love you so much. I donated $25. Savannah again with donating 20 potatoes. But she's questioning it. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think these are new ones. That's why or something. I don't know. This website is confusing me. I've never heard of it. I think it's just late. there's so many people on it that it's like slow to like let me know what people are saying. I just need to pick someone. I just get so excited. I want to read all the comments. Danielle Murray's donated $15. I'm a college student in Mississippi. I'm so glad I could donate. With so many bad things happening, thank you for doing something good. You're Reach. doing something good. You all are. Like, you should all be stoked that, like, in a world, like, 2018 has mm -hmm. been rough. And to have, um, you know, so much negativity and horrible things happening and to have so many people gathering together on the internet to show the good side of the internet, show that we can raise money and help kids with cancer, like, you guys are doing good, so thank you. Um, oh, Caitlin said, hi, Colleen. I can't donate much as I am also pregnant. <laughs> Girl, thank you for your service. My grandpa passed away from pancreatic cancer, so I know every dollar helps. Thank you so much, Caitlin. Um, Alina, Alana said, I'm a college student from Russia. Happy to help children from other countries too because it sucks everywhere. Yeah. Lauren said, I know it's not a ton of money, but I hope it will help. She donated $15. Thank you, Lauren. Sorry, I'm going to pick someone. I'm just enjoying reading the comments. <laughs> the link is below if you're just now tuning in. We're raising money for childhood cancer. Um, fighting it. Yes, fighting childhood cancer, not like... <sighs> we all know. Oops, wait. Do not know how that, <laughs> that internet works. Um. Oh, the emojis turn into question marks. Oh. oh. <laughs> okay, so let's do Cassandra Beaver. She donated ten dollars, and she said, "My son takes chemo since last November to keep him alive. He is mm -hmm. an autoimmune hepatitis. He is five to ten years at most. He has five to ten years at most. Oh my gosh." Well, hopefully the, the most is wrong and there's a lot more than that. So um, thank you so much for donating when you're struggling with that and going through it yourself and donating to other people. Like that is the most selfless thing in the world because as someone who has a kid going through that, um, obviously you'd want to spend every penny that you have on your own son. So the fact that you're donating to other people means a lot. So um, you're going to get this pretty palette and you can do your makeup and, and feel pretty for, you know, I'm sure you're beautiful every day, but sometimes it just feels good to put on some makeup and you also get these shirts, 
So um, is there any more, is there, get a cat sweatshirt too. I'm gonna wear a cozy sweatshirt. And most importantly, socks. There you go. Okay. Next, we're going to do, oh, Jessica said, Parker is crying because you're doing the sparkly rainbow dress. <laughs> <laughs> I have more sparkly dresses, don't worry. But we guess what he's got? Oh, Fuck, that now? Yes, so Parker. Sorry, it's a buddy. good thing we're donating it because then someone else gets to enjoy it and it's helping kids who are in the hospital. So, what else? Um, let's do spread happiness and moods because it's from tour and socks. We're getting down to the wire, y'all. <laughs> okay, so this is a dress that I wore on tour. I had a few sparkly dresses that I would switch in and out of for different nights on tour, but I wore this prego on this most recent tour. I wore it a lot when I was pregnant. So there's pictures of me performing in this with my tiny little baby bump that I thought was Huge. Yeah. I thought it was, the, I thought I looked nine months pregnant and now I look at pictures of me in this dress and it just looks like I ate a real big burrito. Like I do have a bump, but it's, it's not big. So this and also, um, a spread happiness shirt and also the mood shirt and also the socks. <coughs> Same. What, so mom? tell me what, I'm not, oh, who taught me to burp ma? <laughs> You okay? So this is gonna be from Twitter again. Mm, yes, I'm gonna go back to Twitter. Someone talk. No, <laughs> <laughs> I'll talk. Yes. So right now we raised fifty-five thousand dollars, eight hundred fifty-five, eight hundred. Oh. $55,922,000. Wow. So we're almost at 56, just a couple more. Wow, that's wild. Ma Marissa Henry says, this fills my heart with a lot of happiness and I've donated once last night and once today. Oh, thank it's all you. I can afford living back at home. So thank you, girls. Thank you. I know what I'll do. I'll go to the GoFundMe. Yeah. Yes. Um, Let's see here. So I started this on GoFundMe and then had to switch. So a few people had donated on here. Um, I just don't know how to get a hold of these people, though, is the problem. How did you do it last year? Yeah, you just click their thing. I think they should have an email connected to them. If I'm yeah. not signed in, I don't think. Yes. Uh oh. Sam Slam, Sam Slam. So don't go donate to the GoFundMe right now because, um, yeah, we, we barely, we put in a little, we, some people donated a little bit, but then we quickly switched to Fundly. And I just wanted to say thank you to the few people who donated there because that money is going to this too. So who donated? Actually, who donated to the GoFundMe? I wonder if anyone will tweet me about it. Um... Oh, people are saying that this is the one I wore at the show that they came to. There's oh, not no. even a baby bum. <laughs> yeah. uh, oh, my gosh. I can read you some from Family Reach. They sent us, like, a whole bunch of people and yeah. like, things that, they like, you guys helped. So... Ariel, she has leukemia, and she got $2,200 for rent. James has Hodg Hodgkin's um, lymphoma. He got $2,000 for his mortgage. Gordon, leukemia, was the boy I read his story about. $1,400 for lodging. Susie, who has leukemia, $1,800 for rent. There's a lot of rent and mortgage, tra transportation, but most of these are like for rent. So you're literally giving someone a roof over their house. You know how like important that is to someone who has cancer? Um, 
that's incredible. You know, a lot of times these kids, you know, they don't stay in the hospital. They stay at home and they have to go back and forth, back and forth to the hospital. And so like to make sure that they have a roof on their head and that's one less thing they have to worry about. Like yeah. that's so cool. Okay, let's do, um. oh my gosh, I don't know. This is so hard. I hate this part. Um, let's do, uh, oh, I don't know. This is so hard. I want to give it to everybody. Can I give it to everybody? Mm -hmm. Well, you need a lot more prizes. I know. Well, I'll come back to the GoFundMe because I don't know. I want to make sure we can message them. Can you log into GoFundMe in another page over here? So you're going to go to Twitter right now? Yeah. Okay. Just because I don't know. Um, what's in here? This is a very hard decision. Rachel, tell a story. One day, I was walking in the woods. You don't have a story? Sure. We don't have woods. I don't have woods either. <laughs> there is someone moving out down the street and they dumped all of their trash onto oh, the street. There you go. Rude. I know. Oh, you did get onto the dope on me. No. No. He's eating a present? He's trying to unwrap presents. How? Mercy! Yeah. Lucy! Or maybe it was a present for him and he could smell that it was a... <laughs> Dogs, no! They they scent that stuff and make it so you know. Um, we're a little pregnant there. So... You just, you just need to pick someone. I know. People are doing it now. Come on. Come on. Don't do it right don't, now. Don't go to GoFundMe. Go to the Fundly page and donate if you can, please. Yeah. Uh, go to the fun, yeah, go to the funly page. Let's see. Lovey, do you have a story to tell anyone? No. Someone needs to talk while I'm picking these things. Sure. Uh, uh, okay, I'll pick it. I'll pick. You guys are not helpful. What do you want me to tell a story about? I can read Eliana. Who? Eliana, H123 Eliana. She wants to win the universe. Um, I mean, the universe, she could win a sparkly dress. One of her favorite things, she were on tour. She donated $20. Let me see in there. So you won this stuff. Now let's do. Eliana. Let's do. Um, posters. Um, no, posters, I'll just throw in all of them. Lemon. There's Starbucks. Yeah. The Starbucks gift bag. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. No, not yet. Let's do... we, we've given away 15 things. No, I want to give away more things. I know. I'm letting well, yeah, you have a whole table. I'm just letting you know how many we give away. Let's you do uh Moose! <laughs> we'll give away Moosey. <laughs> Here he comes! Yeah. Alright, show me all. How about my diary? Socks, the blue hair's back off shirt. Who wants this moose poo? Um, I'll take moose poos. This one's no. a double sock. <laughs> double sock? Double Two sock. Two socks? Whoa. Okay. Oh, so um, I'm going to go to, is this something? Yeah. So let's, this one will go to, uh, let's see more. How do I, sometimes it like shows you a message, but it doesn't show like the donation. Do you know what I mean? Oh. Uh, um, this one's logged in. Are you logged in? Oh, no. Thank you. That's helpful. It doesn't, you don't have to tell a story about childhood cancer. You can tell a story about anything just while I'm looking. I, well, I mean, I, Rachel, how's your fence going? Uh, well, I hired a guy to put in an electric sliding fence on my driveway, and he's coming next week to install it. Yay! Yeah. Eric, what do you want for Christmas? What are you doing next to this? Okay. 
How about <laughs> Julianne Gianotti? She donated to the GoFundMe before I switched over to Fundly. So keep donating to Fundly. Don't don't go donate to the Go GoFundMe. We're gonna take that money and donate it. But you and the two socks, Julianne, and the my diary. I don't know if she's watching. And the Haters Back Off shirt. Great shirt. Is that very long name? I wear this. And then okay, go ahead and I don't know how to do that, but next. Thank you. Next. Stop it. Thank you. Stop. Next. I'm so grateful for my yes. Please stop. Please stop. <laughs> Why? Okay, so keep donating, guys. We are doing so great, and the prizes are dwindling, which means now's the time to donate because we're looking at the donations right now. I'm going to look and see what we're at. I'm so grateful for my yes. Uh, 57,000. Let's get to 60. Oh my gosh. Let's do. Yeah, that's a good prize. This is another haters back off prize. What are we doing here? I'm creating. Eric picked out this prize. This is another Emily painting. That one's cool. It's very fall. This is an Emily painting from Haters Back Off, season two. A spread happiness shirt. A Miranda sweatshirt. And of course. Oh, of course. Oh. So that is the prize we are giving away. This is actually from a Netflix original series. So hello. Um she's scrolling through Fundly at the moment. She's scrolling. I wish you could see more of the. Oh, oh, you oh. She doesn't know how the internet works. I literally don't. <laughs> <laughs> Patrice Mooney donated a hundred dollars. She gets it. That's you. Maybe somebody else did it. Oh, that was it. Did you do it? Is that from you? Maybe someone else did it. You did it. Thank you, love. If you don't tell the truth, she's going to send it to you. I know. What if I send it to you? <laughs> That'd be awesome. <laughs> um, let's see. Oh, my gosh. There's so many options. I feel like Sarah donated $510, and I know she's a big fan of Haters Back Off because that's how she found us all. And this is an Emily painting, so I feel like she should get a Haters Back Off memorabilia thing. She's really nice in the right issue. Yeah, she's the best. Sarah's the sweetest ever. Okay, let's see. The next thing we're going to do. Wait, I don't think this is true. Someone said you can only donate to the fundraiser if you're an American. That's not true. No, because I just saw someone who I know is not in America and she donated. Yeah. Um, we know you guys. Oh, you guys are all your tweets are so sweet. Yeah, Ariana officially broke the YouTube record for oh my gosh. most views 24 hours. This live stream is about to break that totally. <laughs> um, I'm gonna search. Let's see, do you want to let okay? Well, then. Well, we're running out of yeah. things. Yeah, this had to come to an end at some point. Oh, I don't want it to be over. Can we find one more big, cool thing in the house that we can give away? Yeah, we like look for something. <laughs> we have we have plenty of stuff over there. I just want more stuff. I don't know. Just like walking right around, looking for cats. Yeah, give away the cats. No, don't give away the cats. Like you can find stuff from you the multiple Miranda plants. room or I don't know. More hater stuff in the garage. There is more hater stuff in the garage. Yeah, you could find something. In there. Yeah. Ooh. We'll look Next. everywhere. Next. Go on a power and sharing. I'm telling you to share your own fundraiser on Facebook. <laughs> I'm so grateful for my ex. <laughs> okay. Hello. Wow. Sorry, it's getting, Christmas. And I'm getting more. So for right now, we'll we'll give away. Okay, how about the blue dress? Mm -hmm. That's not blue. Yeah, it is. Are you? Is that blue? It looks purple. What? That's blue. That is blue. Yeah, that is purple. 
purple. No, it's purple. It's that is a blue dress. This is indigo. That's, That's purple. Blue. Like, That's blue. very blue. Bluey purple. That is purple. Bluey purple. This is blue. That is purple. Indigo. Oh my god! Is th do I have a new dress? That's like the new breaking the internet. Yeah, you do. No, this, this is. is purple. Are you kidding me? This is Let me see this. purple. Stop! This is purple. Let me see. That's this. navy blue. Yeah. No. No. no it is. That's purple. Look, I'm gonna show you that it's blue. I'm gonna Whatever show you right, right now. That's right. purple. I'm gonna show you in a picture. You know, it kind of looks navy blue. I get that there's. I something. get it too. Like if but I it's purple. I, that. You think that's purple? Okay, that's blue. But that's, that's that dress. That has filters on it. So this is this dress. So I wore it in this picture, and I posted it all over Instagram. And then I did it in my most uh, one of my most recent videos, where as a pregnant person, I wore the same outfit I wore before I was pregnant. And I look large and in charge here, and skinny mini over here. And that's what that dress is. I've also worn it to VidCon. I've worn it to a bunch of stuff. So that's that dress. Um, but it's definitely blue. Leave a comment. <laughs> is that blue or purple? Because it's blue. It's, it's not purple. It's blue. blue. Any, in any case, it's being given away. And so we're yeah, giving that away to someone who donates. Let's also add a spread happiness shirt. The blue one. <laughs> and some socks. Awesome. Um, okay, you guys, it's definitely blue. No, it could be purple. It's blue. It could be either, but it's purple. It's purple. You see, it when Mom has it up to her chest, it looks purple. Char like, says it's blue. It's blurple. You found the one person blurple. that agreed with you. No, right. it's blue. Um, okay. You guys, it is obviously blue. Blurple dress. I put blue purple. It's blue. I put blurple. Blurple. Um, Corey, what were you seeing in your head as you danced? I'm something bubble my age. See, people are saying it's definitely blue. Yeah. You're definitely not looking at it. See, There's a filter in real life. on the computer. It might be this lighting. This it lighting. might be the lighting. It's blue. Okay. Yeah, no, I can move it around. Yeah, I can see it as either. It's blue. It's dark blue here. When you run away with it, it looks blue. It's blue! When you run away with it. <laughs> My mom keeps running back and forth, though. You're just lying. <gasps> Simone said it's definitely purple. You're a liar, Simone. Simone and me, best friends Simone. forever. Simone is wrong. See, no, it looks... They put it in the sunlight. That's its true form. Um, okay. It's sparkles. It's a vampire. You guys, it's blue. Someone say, yo, kick Rachel out. <laughs> <laughs> it's freaking purple, Lauren says. It's purple. It's blue, you guys are cray cray. See, sometimes it's oh! so much to do it. Oh! Okay, let's do Elizabeth, Andy's Colleen. She said she donated $10. It's not a lot, but I'm so happy to be able to donate for three years now. I'm so proud of you for doing this. I love you. Let me see her. Um, hold on, let me see. She, doing? she said, the blue dress is so pretty. I'd love That's to That's why it. you picked her. Okay. And Go on. Um, okay. I'm almost drinking this whole thing. I'm so proud of myself. I don't like water. Same. <laughs> so it's hard for me Usually to Usually you're just chewing on ice. I know. Um, okay, let's do the next thing will be uh, this is so hard. Let's do the Starbucks. What is it? Starbucks? We'll see. Starbucks. It's off. This is a Starbucks Prezi. Prezi is short for present. Uh, I want this for Christmas. Take notes because this is cute. Um, I live on these, like this, there's always one of these in my hands. There's always one of these in Corey's hands. And since it's so important to us in our life, we wanted to give away to one of you guys. And we also have this cute little mug for hot cocoa and a gift card. 20, 20 Dolores. It's so cute. Why does it look like this? Oh, so you can hang it on your tree? Yeah. Oh, so that's it's just cute. the cutest. <laughs> we can't give away that because we need it. For, well, I guess not. I guess we, Old. That's iconic. Mm -hmm. that is People are gonna know how you do it. I'm not gonna show them. Only the winner will know. What would it be like? So anyway, Starbucks, 
is the prize right now and to talks. all our talks and to win all you have to do is donate so go donate right now i'm looking at the fundraiser page to see how it's going and see we're at fifty-eight thousand. come on get it to 60 um let's see if we can do it y'all i have to go to the i know i know i know i know but i'm just looking at something else so last year what it's like i'm looking at last year's fundraiser. oh i was saying what to dad <laughs> And it's looking like last year we raised fifty eight thousand. So we surpassed it by six hundred so far. Let's get it past it even more. We need more. Yes. More money for the children. Money for the children. Okay. Um. Okay. Fifty nine. Yeah. I think uh, last. I think last year we got to sixty, and then people withdrew their donate. A couple people withdrew their donations. Yeah, because so apparently the thing is that people donate for prizes and then when they don't win, they like retract it. Don't no, give no, them no, any no, ideas. No. Don't you do that. I don't even know do that. How that terrible so of a wrong. human being yeah. can you be? It's so You sad. are trash. Oh, utter goodness. trash. Whoa. I'm sorry. <laughs> donate money and then you're like, take that. Well, there's also, it's like, it's, it's money for kids, money for families. It's money yeah. For kids dying this of cancer. For, it's like, oh, uh, oh. You literally have to be heartless. If you that. did that, just leave this family right now. I just dropped a banana chip and it didn't go on the floor because it landed on my stomach. <laughs> that was the only good moment of my entire pregnancy. <laughs> the only benefit to being pregnant was what just happened to be. <laughs> what? Yeah, look at this. I was like, oh, oh, it didn't work my. that time. Okay. All right. The next prize. Mm -hmm. Wait, you've been giving away the Starbucks. Yeah, you haven't oh. done it yet. I'm more about this. Okay. Let me look. I'll do it on the actual fun funly. If you want to do the Starbucks stuff. <laughs> oh wait. I'll give it away when we hit sixty. Oh, you'll give away the Starbucks when we hit sixty. Mm -hmm. Okay. So what's the next one? No, it? we're not giving away anything until we get 60000 Oh. So go donate. Stop I know. Take back, C's. Yeah, that's Crap. so annoying. Don't Crap. do that. Um, let's see. What else can I talk about? There's this family. Mm-hmm. Elizabeth Lizzie is a brave four-year-old little girl who's um, with her parents and four sisters in Minnesota. Um, she was diagnosed with leukemia, immediately began intensive care treatment, and expected to last about 2.5 years. Oh. And sadly, after the first few months of chemotherapy, Lizzie's cancer proved non-responsive and a more aggressive approach was needed. This was meant at a significant more amount of time spent in the inpatient and traveling back and forth from the hospital would be necessarily necessary. Um, when the family received support from fam from family and surrounding from the community, the financial impact of Lizzie's diagnosis threatened their stability. Carrie and Steve, which is the mom and dad, quickly found themselves unsure of how they're going to continue to keep a roof over their heads while also accessing the care for their youngest child they, that who she desperately needed. No. And said their hospital social worker contacted Family Reach and a grant funded by you and your fans, which is you right there, and supporters was issued covering costs associated with the family's housing. With this essential needed address, Carrie and Steve were able to focus their energies on their daughter's well being. And then this is from the mom and dad. They said, Our Lizzie is a brave, unicorn loving little trooper who goes through um, every day with a smile on her face. She is our strength. It has been tough, but the, with foundations like yours, we are getting by. Thank you so much for your kindness. We appreciate it more than you know. It's a tremendous help. So you That's guys, who you're helping. Aren't you guys so excited? You're a little four-year-old girl. I think that's awesome. That's amazing. Okay, what are we okay. at? $100 away. $100 away. <gasps> We're almost oh to 60. God, oh my God, you guys. Looks like something in the something. Sign. Did you see the size of a jiggle? <laughs> did you fart or did the dog fart? I didn't fart. Oh, the I dog breaks. <laughs> Moose doesn't really fart. No, he never farts. Eric. Eric, was it you? 
It was? I've never smelled oh, an Eric fart. Tell us about. Are we almost there? Mm hmm? Almost. 60,000. Let's do Emma Burton. Oh, I love Emma. <laughs> she won a Starbucks gift package worth $1 million. And socks. And socks. Yeah, the most important part. Okay. Derek, yeah. you're going to show up next thing while I because I'm pregnant and I have to pee every five minutes. Come on, face your fears. Whatever you want it to be. So uh, Eric's gonna come show you the next prize while I'm peeing. Oh yeah. Nubby, it's for child cancer. The peas usually take about five minutes. <laughs> okay. Uh, the next prize. Okay. Is um speak clearly. <laughs> I'm gonna mumble this. Uh, we have a spread happiness sweatshirt in pink. It's great. It is great. Spread happiness t-shirt. Right. Oh, sweatshirt. 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 That's what I meant. Super comfy. I just I literally just took it out of Colleen's closet. Uh, then we have a so fainted hat, <laughs> which is uh Ballinger, which a Parker Ballinger made made famous. These are great. Design? I wear it all the time. This was mine, and I'm going it away. And this is really cool. This is uh, from season two of Haters Back Off. This is an actual prop from the show. This is one of um, Uncle Jim's five phase plan for becoming a legend. Mm. And uh, this was an actual, actual season two in the show. And we have one of these frames here. You do? So, where? Stay with me on this. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, we, we have one that I has been meaning to be frank. No, we do. It's, got in, it. it's in the garage. Ah, got it. Um, but Uncle Jim, played by Steve Little, who does, and of course, socks. Done. Perfect. Rock socks. So All right. Who, want, who wants that? Uh, do you want to pick from Twitter or Funly? You're, uh, picking. You're picking. I'll pick from uh, Twitter. All right, Twitter. I'm going to do that. <laughs> You go to Twitter and uh, see if someone has screenshot it that they've donated. Oh my god. This is, by the way, <laughs> so terrifying for me to be doing. Have you ever done something where you can see yourself while doing it? Mm -hmm. Is it weird that you can see yourself? Because when you get filmed, usually you can't see what's going on. Yeah, no, this is, this is honestly me facing one of my hands. Uh, oh, you did it for the children. Think of the children. She's not going back anytime soon. I don't, I don't know <laughs> someone like uh, someone like already got a prize. Or well, show me. I'll let you know if they did. <laughs> moose, moose, no moose. moose. He's picking a winner. He's oh, having yeah. stressful? It's so stressful, yeah. What are we doing um, today? This. Five face plan, spread happiness sweatshirt, so fainted. So fainted! And socks. Socks. Okay. Yeah, isn't it stressful? I told you. It's like really hard to pick people. Yeah. Sarah, sweetie, tweety. Tweety bird. Twitty. Um, She's from New York. Here, wait, hold on. Let me write down that. And she wants the five phase plan in her bedroom. Hey, let me see, Sarah. Wait, let me come, come back, come back. Sweetie, is that a double T at the end of? Got it. Yep. There we go. I followed you. What is it? Sweet. She goes. I made the username when I was ten. <laughs> <laughs> we all had those. Don't worry about it. Tea. Okay. Congrats, Sarah. Thank you for donating. Congrats. Thank you so much. All right. What's next? We're down to the wire, y'all. Uh, mm -hmm. we got mm -hmm. <laughs> the blue sweatpants is haters back off. So <laughs> okay. Um, on the sweatpants. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
these ones. Mm -hmm. Okay. And Emily, please change the tears back off. Talk of, wait, what are, what are we giving away here? It's a drawing. Mm -hmm. What is it? Morgan's drawing? Yeah, you can do a reveal. The final yeah. reveal? Final reveal. So Parker Ballinger, Talk you? About okay. Talk about hope. I use this when I go do collabs with people. Story. I put my Miranda outfit in there. And I'm like, okay, I'm ready to climb y'all. And another one of the drawings from Hitters Back Off. I don't want to put that where wet things were. Because my drinks and things. These sweatpants are from Haters Back Off. I'm sad about these. I loved these. I wore them a lot on the show. The scene I can remember wearing the first season one, episode five, the Annie episode in the backyard. I wore it at the beginning of the episode. I'm wearing a giraffe sweatshirt and these blue pants. And I remember um, I walked on set and I had gotten a facial the day before. I'd never had a facial before. Like an intense facial where they sucked everything out of your face. Oh, sounds lovely. And I walk on set and I had my first scene with Angela. It's like six in the morning. And she goes, you look 14 years old. <laughs> and I was like, really? I'm getting facials every day. But I think it was just because I was wearing a huge oversized sweatshirt. And uh, these huge, but these were so cozy on set. I loved these sweatpants. I wore them in a lot of episodes. But that's the one I remember the most. And the slacks. Whoa. Why did I just say it like that? I love slacks. <laughs> <laughs> and the socks too. There you go. Um, someone just said, "Hey, are you pregnant?" Mm -mm. Nope. Okay. I'm getting down to the wire, y'all. Getting down to the wire. Let's see what we're at. This internet is. Get off that oh, I know. <laughs> Yikes. Oh, we're at. We're at 61,666. Oh, now it's 63. Okay, there we go. I feel better. Um, let's see. I wonder if we can get to what should, should we have a new goal of like what we should get to before it's over? Like we'll just 70. Keep... 70? That's going to take seven let's hours. Let's get 65. Why? Let's try for 70. I think we're going to try for 70. And I'm literally just going to keep finding things in my house to give away. <laughs> I think maybe maybe I'll give away one of my ukuleles. Oh! He is shut there's one upstairs hanging on the wall that um, there's a couple that I can't part with. But um, yeah, let me go grab them. Um, so what are we doing with the bag? Okay. So this one we'll give away once we get to 62 because because. Oh my gosh, I can't believe we're trying for 70. We're literally gonna be here for 17 years because that's a lot of money. But I don't like the number six. Lunch. <laughs> We'll keep eating banana chips. That's not lunch. Postmates. Postmates something. I'm not. Veggie I'm girls down the street. Cheap. cheap. <laughs> I do have a turkey sandwich I like there at Veggie Girl. Oh my gosh, shipping this stuff. I'm like, just shipping. I'm like, let's give away a couch. I know. You can, she can make <laughs> shipping a ukulele. Should I give this away? I'm like, that is 300 pounds. It's going to go so much. ship that. Um, okay. Oh, everyone really wants that ukulele. Ukulele? Oh my gosh, my nose itches. That should be seventy thousand. The ukulele sign. That'll be the final thing. I'll Coley sign Ballinger a ukulele. Sign ukulele. That is seventy thousand, y'all. Yeah. If we, so I'm only gonna give away a ukulele if we hit seventy thousand. Okay. That's the tea. Oh, thanks. My mom brought me over to. I thought your mom was like nasty. <laughs> <laughs> I would do that. I would do that for tissue. Um. Okay. Let's get it to 70,000. We're not even out of 61 yet, which is what I'm waiting for. By the way, this is caffeine free. Don't come for me. I'm pregnant. I know I can't have caffeine, but I still have caffeine. Sometimes I have a coffee and sometimes I have a Coca Cola. But this one's caffeine free. So don't come for me. Come for me when I actually drink caffeine. Also, it doesn't affect the baby really, unless you drink a lot of it. And even then, it doesn't really affect the baby. It's fine. I need to drink your soda. I'm just saying, I like hate when people come for me and stuff pregnancy. People are bored. Oh, my nose. Uh, refresh. I'm sure you hit it. I know. Have we hit it yet? Oh, my goodness. Here we did it! 62. Yes! Oh, oh my gosh. This All is right, so to forever to get 70. Talk about, oh, there's haters back off some here. It's really bad. 
that's gonna be a hard one. Are you looking on Twitter or Friendly? Friendly's being slow right now, so I'm gonna do Twitter again. Um, so show me that you've donated. Aw. How about Alexa? Because she said she donated $10. She'd love to win the Emily drawing because she's her favorite character from Haters Back Off. And she has a picture of her and Francesca, who plays my sister. Um, she lost a classmate due to cancer. And the fact that you're spreading awareness means so much. Love you lots. So Alexa. So good. Mm -hmm. Got it. I wish I had something from the Ariana music video shoot. Okay. Yeah. I think I have the shorts that I wore underneath the cheerleading costume. I am sure you have not washed those yet. No, they're washed. Oh, okay. Because I saw them in my, my short store today and I was like, uh, why do I have these? And I just now remembering that that's what they are. <gasps> Got it. That one? Where did you get that? I, think I bought that one for myself. Okay. That's from when you bought in Hawaii? I, I bought you one wine. No, I'm not giving away the one. And this is the last one. The one to give me that one, and then there's right. my birthday one. I bought that one for myself, I think, or you bought that one for me. You, you bought that one for me. I bought you one in Hawaii, yes. yeah. Well, you're not giving this away until you hit 70, though, right? By the way, my ukuleles are my most prized possessions. And I can't believe I'm going to give one away. We have 70,000. So I have, I think, I think I have like six ukuleles. Please donate to child with cancer. They need your money because it's really. Who ever has a cancer? Prancer. So on Dasher and Dancer. <laughs> Please donate to child of cancer. Giving them your money is always the answer. They need your help because then it's expensive. What runs with expensive? And then Sam Rams, then the son of my senses. So, scene. <laughs> We're not giving, wait, what are we giving away? We haven't even yeah, got so. Um. Not the shoes, love, because those are, I don't think I've worn those. Oh, don't you me. But I like the spread having this crappie. Good, good choice. I you can get away my mask for mask. <gasps> yeah, I love your mask for mask. mask for mask for sure. Mask for mask. With the crappie? Um, no, just this. Oh. Oh, wait, I think they go I good together. It. Mask for mask with the spread having this crop. Okay, yeah. So okay. anyway, Corey's, I love this sweatshirt. Mask for mask sweatshirt. So if you want to win this one, tweet Corey. At Core Soto, right? Yeah. And the spread happiness. Oh, and socks. Hello. Um, tweet Corey at Core Soto, K O R S O T O, and showing how much you donated because he's going to pick a winner for this one. Okay. Are you doing the crop? Um, the crop, yeah. No, do have the next one. Oh, we're right. just doing mask for mask and socks then. Someone said they wanted a banana chip, so I think I'm also going to give away one banana chip. These are good. You get these at Trader Joe's. No, but I'm serious. I think I'm gonna mail just no, this. I'm just. I'm not doubting you in the slightest. But you also just ate what you were gonna say. I'm gonna out. sign it. You're still eating it. I don't think I'm gonna lie. Okay. Then I have a bag. Looks like a good one. So Corey's picking up a winner. I'm gonna do. Sounds pretty good. Claire. Claire. Ballinger cuties. Claire, She's, you won mask for mask. She said, I could only donate $20, but I know everything helps. I come to understand how truly devastating cancer can be, not only on the patient, but on all of the loved ones, too. So proud of the internet for using your power for good. Don't ask your mom what mask for mask means. So Ballinger cuties, Claire Bear. Just kidding. No, she's friends of the gay. She understands. She knows. The next prize will be, mm, where are we at? Oh, the banana chip. Okay, you oh, have to also give something else away. Again. No, banana chips and socks. Banana chips and socks. We're doing banana chips and socks, y'all. 
You get one singular banana chip. We're only at 62 times. We're not going to get no, to 70. No, us practically 63. Ugh, we're never going to get to 70,000. Yeah, we're all. Yeah. Oh, this is the last one. You have more? Oh, we have. Do we have, Do more, we have socks? more socks? Oh, yes. Do we have more socks? She asks. I love you. And it's all. Oh my gosh, it's Christmas time. Why don't you just put those in all the ones that you've done and that have already donated? You just throw those in. These are ornaments. These are just put those in the ones you've already done. Ornaments and they're signed. Can I have one for my yeah. tree? Thanks. Um, I donated it. I get one. So we're giving away the banana chip. Show me that you want this banana chip by donating now. <laughs> we gave that away last year too. Let's do it. Eric or following this year. You care, Eric? No. Yeah, I'm Eric wore this for Halloween this year. We had one last year that Coney and I wore for our video for. He wore this at the lipstick launch party. Mm -hmm. but Eric wore I this. kissed him in that. Oh. Eric wore this. Colleen gave him some action in this. Ah! I would say that. <laughs> Colleen kissed him in this. Action. Getting the kiss is action. Um, so we're giving away a banana chip right now. Oh. And it go does it go with the frost toast? Uh, no, the banana chip is just a banana chip. And and socks. Oh. That's like a thank you card. Gotcha. You could have oh, wait, I'm supposed to be vlogging and I have none. So here, and you can give away and sign this puller that you just took. Not with a banana chip. The banana chip is, I want them to appreciate just the banana just chip. Just a banana chip. I want to see, tweet me if you want the banana chip, okay? Yes. We're giving away a banana chip. So far, we've raised sixty-two thousand dollars. We're giving away great prices, like this <laughs> banana chip. We're running out. Like we're out of. We're almost out of prices. There's still a couple that are pretty killer, and so, but we don't want to be done because we really want to get to seventy thousand. I hope we can do it. Um, so we're trying our hardest to get seventy thousand, and so now we're giving away things like banana chips. That's for my vlog. Um, maybe I should. End. Oh, we're at sixty-three thousand. It's time to get away with the banana chip. Okay, banana time chip to give away the banana chip. I'm like, no, I don't want it. You don't know, right? No, people want it. People want it. Um, yeah, you can take the pictures. Okay, that's a good idea. See, everyone's saying they want it. I love you guys. That's the big one. Record player, color cameras, ukuleles? No. Oh, no. Oh, banana chip. So, okay, like, listen. Sorry, you're not winning this. So don't get excited when your name. But Heather said, um, I want the banana chip. I really only want that and your book. No. Book's not part of the prize. So since you said you wanted the book, <laughs> too. No, you almost got it, but then you, you got greedy. Got it, but you said you wanted the book as well. So. Don't get greedy. <laughs> Everyone's saying they want the banana chip. I got to see proof that you donated, honey, bunny. I love that chip. <laughs> Desperate to win anything, especially the banana chip. <laughs> You want to see that they donated or that they spread the word. There you go. I need that nanner chip. <laughs> Queen, please. Please, I want the chip. It's actually a plantain chip, I'll which is a chip. family of the banana family. So. I'll take the chip as long as I get some of those amazing socks. Now, while it does come with the socks, that I want you to appreciate just the banana chip. Mm. So, Emily, I'm sorry. <laughs> Amile. <laughs> Are you signing the chip? I'm, yes, I'm going to sign the chip. Yes, please, a banana chip from you. Anything, I love it. How do they laugh? <laughs> It'll be molded by the time it gets to you. Everyone needs a good banana chip. Pick one! <laughs> I'm having too much fun watching people fight over the banana chip. Go <laughs> You know, like the banana chips that are like sweet and actually good? These ones are salty. <laughs> yeah, they're delicious. <laughs> and tasteless. No, these are delicious. I love these ones. These plantain chips are the best. They taste like tree bark. It's like a healthy version of a tortilla chip. Yeah. They're making me feel kind of sick, though. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, so Don't eat the chip. I need to find someone who's going to appreciate it. Okay, how about Amara? Amara said she Oh, I love Amara. The banana is all I need in life right now, she <laughs> says. Same girl. What's her handle? A-M-A-R-A-H-C-M-D. She won that banana chip and the socks. Congrats. So that's a good prize. Let's see where we're at. And I can sing a song. 63. 63. Oh my gosh, you guys, we're never going to get to 70. Don't I'm sorry to be negative, Nancy, but. 
it just feels like we can do it. What's the next thing you want to give away? Um, we have, oh, I had thought of something good. You have a table of things. I know, but it's like just a more. Christmas tree. Oh, the taco. We're doing taco. Oh, the taco. Oh, it's a taco. It's a taco. Let me tune this. I'll play you guys a song. I'll play Thank You Next. This is the taco. Shouldn't Eric model this one? Yeah. Yes, Eric. Eric needs to model this taco. <laughs> Great idea. <laughs> Eric's gonna model the taco. The oh, I wanted an Insta story. That's what I wanted to do. Is it just that? And the socks. Okay, you can yeah. strap yourself up. Everyone, we are still raising money to help kids with cancer. So please swipe up, join the live stream, um, and enter to win. Um, not enter to win, because actually donating to kids with... Okay, I'm going to try again. <laughs> I'm posting that. I got distracted by the taco, okay? Hello? Sorry, I was distracted by the taco. But please swipe up and um, donate money. You're helping a kid with cancer. And also, we're giving away a lot of cool prizes. So um, please come join us. It's almost over, so you don't have a lot of time. But please, we're really, really trying to hit our goal. And help us. Swipe up. Oh, look so stupid. Modeling the socks. You got socks. Oh, my gosh. He put on the socks. There's a reveal, love. Oh, sorry. Rachel already said it. Okay, swipe up. So if you want, can you come get in the frame so they can see you? You need the final yeah. reveal? This is the final reveal. Eric's in the taco. Photo soccer. And the Crocs. And da 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 It looks like I'm actually wearing a Crocs. <laughs> kind of. Kind of does, huh? That is supposed to, that's the point. On camera. camera looks like. Oh my gosh, I tuned it by ear so perfectly. Love that for me. Okay, I'm going to play some thank you next. So you guys can all donate to Funly right now to win that taco costume that is on Eric's body. And uh, I'll play thank you next while you guys are. Now, do they get the used sock or new socks? I put it on over my socks. He get you get a new pair of socks and the sock that Eric put on his foot. So you get two pairs of socks, really? Well, no, just the one. Oh, so just the two and a half. Pair? You get one and a half pairs of socks. Okay. What do we do with the other long socks? The donations are going crazy for this taco. <laughs> okay, ready? We're gonna do some thank you next. I will believe out the bad words. Don't worry. The bad words. Thank you. Yes. Are you serious? <laughs> I'm so effing grateful for my ex. Oh. I just jam out. I don't even hear it. I have to figure out. I'm trying to find what it is. Because he was an angel. There we go. One time you love, oh. one time you patient, no. one time you patient. What are you doing? Now I'm yeah, so amazed, I thought that I belonged to so what I see, look what I got, look what you tell me, and for that I say. Wait. What's wrong? Sorry guys, I'm sight reading. This is not good. It does, bro. I almost just showed you where my baby's coming out. Sorry about that. Thank you, next, thank you, next, come on, thank you, next, I'm, I'm so beeping, grateful for my ex, thank you, next, thank you, next, thank you, next, thank you, next. I'm so, spend my time with my friends, I worry about nothing, unless I met someone else, we have met in discussions, I know they say I move on to, wait, on too fast, but this one won't last. Cause her name is Ari, and I'm so good with that. The first time I heard that, I was like, yes! Yes, Ariana! <laughs> she taught me love, she taught me patience, and no pain. Sorry, that beep's amazing. Love that I'm lost, that's not what I see. Look what I found, no need for searching. And for that I say, guessing with me. 
goodness. Corey just got the most epic text message in the world. I'm shook. That's a really good prize. Wait, let me read it one more time. Wait, hold on. Um, oh my gosh. That's a really good prize. And I feel like, okay, I'm about to shake you all to the core. That's insane. So Funny, I was just singing Ariana Grande because we, uh, Corey is friends with one of the producers of Ellen and he's really, really sweet. I met him a few times. He's lovely. Like Surprise kids this show. Wonderful. Cool. Like, yeah, he's, he's wonderful. I love him. And he just texts Corey and said, he's going to give away tickets to Ariana Grande's concert in Los what? Angeles. What? What? Screw the ukulele. I know. Who's that 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 what about the taco costume? <laughs> <laughs> We're still giving away the taco costume, but that we, how many did you say? Four. Four wow. tickets. So we'll give away two and two. Wait, can I? No. I know, right? No. <laughs> no, we, no, we can buy our own tickets. <laughs> um, oh my gosh. Thank wow. you. So, thank you so, so, so much. I am floored. So we are going to give away Jeez. Ariana Grande concert tickets. To Los Angeles, so you need to be able to get yourself to LA, and you need, to, or you need to live in LA, because um, otherwise, I don't know how you would go. <laughs> um, I don't know. We'll look that. We'll look into that. We're gonna look into that while we're giving away the taco costume. Oh, Eric's taking off his taco costume. Well, nobody cares. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not stupid. They want the taco costume. Um, oh my goodness. Take a taco costume with. Okay, I'm doing that now. Eric, people still want your taco costume. Refresh. I want to see how many people have donated since that Ariana Grande news. So, yeah, to win an Ariana Grande tickets, just uh, donate and um, or spread the word. But, like, I feel like you have to live in L.A. We're not going yeah, to we're not yeah. gonna pay for a flight to their side. Yeah, and the hotels and all that stuff. So you have to live in L.A. Or have to get yourself to L.A. Yeah. People are still winning the banana chip. Give that away. <laughs> <laughs> banana chip's done, guys. It's like Ariana Grande. Where's the banana, banana chip? chip. Um, okay, how about... Here we go. Lauren. L-A-U-R-Y-A-N. And her Twitter handle is at Colleen at last. And she said, I would really love to win the taco. This is my third year donating. And I did it in honor of two people who are close to me. And she said, in honor of, donated in honor of a little boy from my church who lost his battle to leukemia and a brain tumor this past January. He was only seven, but he taught me so much about perseverance and courage and being kind. So this sweetie, cutie patootie, only seven years old, um, lost his battle to cancer. And um, that is so kind of you, Lauren, to donate in his honor. And uh, everyone who's donating, you're helping little kids just like him. So... I think she's the perfect person to get the taco. And what else? Socks. And a sock. I <laughs> use sock. One and a half socks. One sock. Oh my goodness gracious. I can't believe those Ariana Grande tickets. That was so kind of him to do. Um, we are at 64,000. When we get to 65, I will give away two tickets to the Ariana Grande concert in Los Angeles, which I'm positive. What are the dates? Do you know what the dates are? Because um, I'm texting right now. Because I can, um, oh my gosh, that's so sweet of him. I can't believe that. Okay. Call it Insta Story that so people come down Yeah, no, I'm going to tweet it. All right. Well, actually, I'll Insta Story it. You can't get it. I told you. Yeah. I can't stop. I can't walk away from it. Are they trying to do it? Yeah. Oh my gosh. We're about to give away tickets to Ariana Grande's concert in Los Angeles. So if you want to win, all you have to do is donate to um, the Fundly account for Childhood Cancer. And you're donating to a great cause. Your money's going to a great place. And you might want to get to see Ariana Grande. Swipe up. Okay, I have to put the swipe up link. I can't believe that. That's, why didn't I think of that? 
Yeah. No, I don't. Nice. <laughs> That's why. That is so sweet. Okay. Here we go. Um, okay, so only hit 65. Oh, this is going to be a hard one to pick, y'all. Because I have to make sure that you can get yourself here. Um, so he thinks it's May 6th. They're at work, so. Okay. I almost just exited out of the live stream, just so you know. Cool thing. Are you shook? I'm just shook. You're almost to 65. <clears throat> Thank you, next. Thank you, next. Yeah, it would be the Staples Center May 6th. May 6th. And I might be at it. So when she kissed your tummy. Yeah. Wipe that off. <laughs> she kissed my tummy. There's actually some like um so in the new Ariana Grande music video, they do next, she kisses my pregnant tummy. And people are like, there's already kiss marks on her tummy. How did that happen? And they're like all trying to look into it. But it's just because she kept kissing it. So she kept coming up and kissing the same spot. It was really sweet. Like she'd come over to my belly and she'd check, make sure I'm okay. And then um, because I was real pregnant, and then she would kiss my tummy. And so she kissed it a bunch, but she always kissed the same spot so that she wasn't getting lip marks all over my stomach. Um but no, I just, I took a shower and wiped it off. <laughs> People are probably screaming right now, but it's just Ari to me. Um, uh, do you want to give away something else well before the Ari tickets? Or well, when we hit 65, I'll give away Ari tickets. And socks? Um, and socks. And socks. Okay. <laughs> Ari had a crowd of tickets and socks. We have to run the socks to the con. Yes, that's the rule. So if you want to win those tickets, but even if you don't want to win those tickets, or if you do want to win those tickets, that should be the reason you donate. I don't want no take backsies up in this ish. I want y'all to donate because you want to donate, okay? And you want to help kids in need. Oh, my nose is so itchy, y'all. This is an issue. Uh, We're at 64,000. Oh, I didn't write that down. Oh, I did. Okay. It's on the taco. Okay. I'm, I'm the taco that. was uh, Lauren. At Colleen at last. At Colleen at last? Yeah, it's the at symbol. Colleen oh gosh, at last. Internet is so bad. It's crazy. Like, like at last I see you. Okay. Yes. We're at 64.5. Are we on the ground? concert tickets. This is a big deal, y'all. I'm feeling real pregnant and tired right now. It's the most pregnant and tired I ever felt. We're really excited and really pumped. We're raising so much money for kids who need it. If we had 70,000. This picture did not turn out, Eric. Hey, why didn't that work? It's because it's bright. And the lights and the flashes on it. So I don't understand why it looks like it's. I don't know, but I looked really ugly in it. So I'm glad I didn't turn out. I don't know. Michelle, you never look ugly. Come on, y'all. Look at my face in this. I'm beautiful, but that's not a flattering face. Well, did you put it on the wrong setting? Well, what should it be on? On indoors. Yeah. Well, it should be actually sun because there's so much light happening. Well, no, because then there'll be less flash. Oh, that's true. You, you need to be on well, home. Here, the three. Lena and Claire. One, two. I blinked. Oh, we hit 65,000. <laughs> Wait, is that what I said I wanted to hit? Yeah. And then the next one will be at 70. Um, that'll take, we'll be sitting at blank. I know. Hour. I got things to do. <laughs> Rochelle, <laughs> that's more important than everything. Okay. All righty, guys. We are picking a winner for the Ariana Grande tickets right now. They don't have to live in LA. Like, yeah, they have to live near. They have to get to LA or you just live somewhere near. It's just drivable. Yeah, we're just giving away tickets. I'm not doing anything. This one looks like it's turning in. Is it? Yeah. I have chosen a winner. <gasps> oh, oh my God. Who is it? For just, so just two. So there's two more after this. There's two more tickets after this. So I'm giving away two tickets right now to Ariana Grande's concert in Los Angeles. Are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Drum roll, please, for the Ariana Grande tickets. Just two, right? Just oh, she's two. cute. I love her. Allie at Holy Ballingers. 
Um, she said, this live stream means so much to me. Thank you for doing it. One of my good friends has a rare type of cancer, and this was the first child in the U.S. to survive. Also in January, I donated 15 inches of my hair to women with cancer, and I donated $10 this year. And then she tweeted me again and said, I donate every year. I'm a huge fan of Ari, and I live in L.A. I would cry if I got the tickets. Please, please. Aww, so yay. not only do you do a lot of amazing things for childhood cancer, thank you. She donated her hair, and she donated money, and she... Um, she has a friend who is a cancer survivor, it sounds like, which is amazing. And um, now you're going to Ariana Grande's concert. So nice. congrats. There are you two are more. screaming right now. You are. <laughs> I hope she's excited. I'm excited for you. Um, there's two more Ariana Grande tickets. And this picture coming up. Oh. <laughs> awesome. And your ukulele. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Let me. Oh, my gosh. This is. It's too much information. I know. I'm, I'm, so I'm having a heart attack. Okay, hold on. Rachel, talk to them about something. But I want to read the text oh message. No. Ah. So up soon will be this picture that's still developing. It is uh, Corey, Colleen, and I doing. Taken by extra. So wait, taken by photographer Eric Stockman. That's all. I'm gonna talk even louder because they're. Speaking and discussing amongst themselves, and I don't think you're supposed to hear it. So this is me. You are all very mad at me for still talking because you want to hear what they're saying, but I'm not going to let you. I have been trained to be an annoying little sister my whole life, so I'm a <laughs> professional at this. Eric, please help me. I'm. Oh, never mind. Okay, we have another big prize. What? I don't even know what it is. I am socks. So. Oh my gosh, he's so sweet. I can't believe this. So now we have two tickets to Ariana's concert left that we'll be giving away. Okay. We have this ukulele, which now is chopped liver. Who cares? But I'm going to sign this. And um, so we're going to give this away. Mm -hmm. And now there are two tickets to the Ellen Show. What? It's not during Christmas giveaway. Oh, I'm not that doing good. But he, uh, they, they said they'll give you one of the prizes from the Christmas giveaways. Because they, but it, it'll be at random. We don't know which one it is. But all the presents they give away are huge and amazing. If you win, will you take me? <laughs> so, anything that you get is gonna be awesome. Yeah. Wow, that is amazing. Oh my I'm gosh. also up to going to the Ariana concert you with you. Something. Oh yes. Thank you. Everything. Oh my gosh. I am shook. This is amazing. Okay, so we have that's all that's left that we're giving away is this mamma jamma socks. Socks. <laughs> Rose does. Yeah, I'll be giving those away to you. Ariana Grande tickets to a show in Los Angeles and show tickets to Ellen. Again, you have to be able to get yourself to Los Angeles to go to these things because because I don't know also how else you would get to come here. <laughs> Um, so it's not an all inclusive package. No, because, well, I mean, as much as I would totally be down to like fly people out, I would rather spend that money, put those thousands of dollars towards kids with cancer and not towards your flight. Does that make sense? Yes. So, um, oh my gosh. <laughs> my friends are texting me that. <laughs> I'm like, oh, the <laughs> they're, they're, they're like, I'm going to Ellen. <laughs> I was like, donate. Let's go. <laughs> donate. 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 Oh my gosh. She tickets to Ellen. That is crazy. I want to go. Take me. We've been to Ellen once. Yes. We and got Pringle we Sticks. We got Pringle Sticks. <laughs> that was the prize to give away that day. I was on been, Ellen. I've been on Ellen. I was dancing. They like showed me dancing because I was being crazy. <laughs> but um, I won like so. I won like a like a I home. I won a <laughs> iPad or something. I won like a crazy thing every time I go. Well, we, we have Pringle we're sticks. really excited. And an antebellum CD. <laughs> yeah, that's what it was. <laughs> antebellum CD and Pringle sticks was our prize. And we were like, we were happy because we were just on. That's we got to go so that's we didn't awesome. care. But um, and who's on Josh Groban and people we didn't really know. Yeah, but but we were there and it was fun. It was fun. Yeah, I think they asked me, like, I was dancing the aisles, like, yeah. against someone, and I lost. Yeah. <laughs> because you lost to a middle -aged, a middle aged woman who was, like, twerking and having fun. I know, and I was like, <sighs> you couldn't win. I was, like, nervous. Oh, we're at 66. Woo! Woo! That was 7,000! 
Oh my god, I'm thinking about he's so nice. I know. I, he's the best person in the world. I, I can't believe he's doing that. That makes me want to cry. That's so, so nice. He's so sweet. He came to our um, Haters Back Off Season 2 premiere. He's been in the Miranda show. He's And I've worked with him because I've done some a couple things with Ellen. Not with Ellen, Ellen, but like for the show, Ellen. Like I interviewed people on the red carpet at the VMAs. Is that mm -hmm. it? Yeah. Um, so he's really, really sweet. I really love, I can't believe he's doing that. So two tickets to Ellen and two tickets to the- Ellen island. had to blur my butt crack, just saying. <gasps> Ellen herself? No, her, 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 her editors had to blur my butt I crack. bet it was Ellen. It was Ellen. <laughs> Ellen. I like to believe Ellen. I like to believe Ellen. I like Ellen. Ellen, all she does- She did she... call me the runner though. Yes. Yes, I want. I want to believe that Ellen. All she does is interview people, and she's like, "Unless you need to blur butt cracks, that's the only one thing I'm." Doing. I was in Target one day, and they're like, "We're doing an Ellen scavenger hunt." I saw that. Yeah. Yeah, and they had to blur my butt crack because I was so competitive that I didn't care that my clothes were like falling off my she, body. What, she, I can't believe you didn't win. I wish she called me the runner. <laughs> she knows me. What's the runner? Was that because I was running and she was like, The runner's coming, she's coming. Uh -huh. And then I got there and she's like, Oh, the runner. Oh, no, never mind. I just went. Uh -huh. <laughs> she was like, for me. Was she, she wasn't there. She was no, she was studio. Skyping it. Okay, so, um, what are we giving away next? Is the question. Well, do you want to give away? Let's give away the um, no, we'll give one more prize of this and then we'll do the Ellen, the Ariana Grande, and the and so let's do the, the sword through neck, the crop, and one of all the things. This is a big package. Yes. Sure. This one's a big old package of Miranda stuff. So this is the final like Miranda package of stuff. What do you got there, Mom? All of That's this. so nice. I can't get over how sweet that Cat is. Sweatshirt. All the all, all, all the, the things. All the things. Well, I'm trying to write it down. Okay, sweatshirt. We're doing moves. Hold on. Give it to her. I'll follow. Oh. Oh. Like, oh, yes. And your drawing. Drawing. So we have this drawing. That Emily did. Um, again, hello, the best prize of them all, the songs, <laughs> the mood shirt. We also have this shirt, which we sold on tour, which I don't even remember. But it says, Can I help you, Miranda? And it's like supposed to look like the button up shirt. I don't know. Don't ask questions. Just accept your gift. The spread happiness shirt, the Miranda sweatshirt, and my crop top, my spread happiness crop top. It has stains on it because I'm a messy eater, so you're welcome. And I wore this all the time um, when I was really tiny and not pregnant. And then I wore it in my video where, as a pregnant woman, I wore the clothes that I wore pre-pregnancy. And this one is so iconic. I can't believe we're giving this away. Sword through neck. So we have a couple of these. This is one I toured with for years and years and years and years. So you can see it's like all tattered and worn because it's been all over the world. I've touched it. It's like flimsy and like breaking. It's just such a mess. So Rachel, do you want to demonstrate? Or Corey want to, actually yeah. Corey's on that side. So. All right. So this is how this works. This, this is, I know it might not work, but we'll see. Lesson. So I put this on in my live show and I go, thank God my, Think down me finally when we say goodbye. <laughs> it's not live. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> you can just edit it. Uh, <laughs> once in a while, please promise me you'll try. Think of me, please say oh. Thank God, Mike. Okay, so that's this. Um, <laughs> And so we're giving, this is the next thing. Alice said she was screaming so loud when she wanted her parents thought something was wrong. Oh my gosh. So that's what we're giving away. This is the last, this is a big Miranda bundle of stuff. And me bundle because my crop top's in there. Sorry. Okay. Oh, and a Froze Toes ornament. We'll, we'll throw these into some of the packages, but we signed those Froze Toes ornaments and we made them by hand. Oh my gosh. Things got, okay, I hope. 67. Oh my gosh, Rosie! So you guys, things have escalated quickly. We've been doing this for two and a half hours, and the people who dipped out in the first hour aren't kicking themselves because oh, the yeah. good prizes showed up. I mean, they're all good prizes, but like, holy smokes, I can't believe the prizes we have now. What? <laughs> the banana chip. I'm talking about the banana chip. Let's be real. So if you're just watching, it's two tickets to Ariana Grande mm -hmm. and two tickets to see Ellen show live. Mm -hmm. 
and uh, a ukulele that was signed by me yes. and a bunch of Miranda merch. And not all these at the same time. These are all separate prices. Right now we're giving away all the Miranda merch. Yeah. And, and that's for minutes. donating to Childhood Cancer, mm-hmm. to Family Reach, and... The Children's Hospital of Los Angeles. Yes. And then Colleen always donates some of her money to personally the families. So every little help counts. Yep, yep, yep. Um, <clears throat> oh, it's real hard to pick. <laughs> People are like, I'll take you to the Ellen show. <laughs> Some people are just saying they want the socks. <laughs> Same. They don't even want the other stuff. They're trying to be appreciative. Yeah. Doing what you told them. We're doing. Oh, it's real hard to pick, y'all. And this was just an email that was sent to us from Family Reach. And they just were, they said, thank you for becoming such an important member to Family Reach family. Not only are you helping to keep many families afloat, but you are helping us tell the real story about what many cancer patients are experiencing. There's so much shame for families who become financially depleted because of cancer. And sadly, there's so much guilt for the children who realize their hardship, their diagnosis has caused for their entire family. Letting people know this ha- this happens to one out of three pediatric cancer families and up to 73% of adults is so important. Wow. Okay, <clears throat> here we go. I'm gonna do, oh no, I don't know. I almost just picked someone and now I'm changing my mind. Um, yeah, I'll do, okay, I'm gonna do, how about this? Let's do Sammy. Salsa? Sammy Sutcliffe. S- Sutcliffe. <laughs> what is Sammy, that? S A M I S U T C L I F F E. I've met her a few times at live shows. Let me see her. And okay. here, I took a screenshot of it. She said she donated $30, holy cow, proud of us all, how magical it is that this fan base can help these families in need. Cancer sucks. My uncle just got diagnosed with cancer a few days ago. I'm heartbroken, and I can't imagine kids going through this. And so, Sammy, thanks for all your support. You've always been, like, such a wonderful, sweet supporter of me and my channel and my family, and now a great supporter of the fundraiser. So thank you. All righty, let's see what we're at, because next up, should we do the Ellen tickets next, or Ariana You're about to become my best friend. <laughs> what should we do next, Ellen or Ariana? Let's do Ellen and end with Ariana. Or wait, Ellen, no, you have the uke. Ooh. Ellen, ukulele, Ari. Ellen, Ari. There you go. Well, but the thing I like about the uke is that it can go to anybody, whereas the Ari and uh, the Ellen, they have to get idea. themselves here. Ellen, Ari, uke. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to give away the Ellen tickets next. So when we hit $68,000 raised, we will give away two tickets to Ellen. And is Rachel included? And Rachel would be cool if you took her. (laughs) Rachel, so you could take your mom or your dad or your best friend to Ellen. Or your new best friend. Or you can go with Rachel. <laughs> I don't know. I don't deliver your socks. I don't know. If this is a, I don't know if this is a serious offer or not. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> but Rachel is currently stating that she will go on a date with you to Ellen. What a date! So and the socks, guys. Yeah. Spankings. You have the socks already, Mom. Uh, you, we can use the socks. This is cut. sweet. Um, Taylor, a girl named Taylor, said, My nephew Jude was diagnosed a year ago with leukemia, and needless to say, <clears throat> it shook all of our worlds. I just downloaded Twitter to tell you how wonderful you are dedicating your birthday to childhood cancer. It needs funding so bad. Love you. It really does. There's like no funding for 
childhood cancer. It's crazy. So just a reminder, we're doing Ellen tickets. Right now. And no take backsies. If you donate just to win tickets and then you take your money back, I will. God is watching. God. You are trash. Santa is watching. Christmas is around the corner. I will personally come to your house. And Christmas is literally around the corner. Do you want coal in your stockings? The money is going to a good cause. So even if you don't win the Ellen tickets or the Ariana tickets or the ukulele, you're still, your money is going to such a good place. And so, yeah. Um, hey, Rachel. Thanks, mom. 68. I don't. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm so nervous. Okay, keep donating right now because I'm looking at people donating right now. I'm, I'm going to go back and forth to Twitter and Friendly. Who's cut there? And Moose is like, I'm going to bed, y'all. You all too much. Oh my gosh. I'm seeing all these people like, please bring it for all people. Please bring it for all. And one person goes, please pick me for the sauce. <laughs> <laughs> Um, oh, it's so hard. Oh, man. And you have to get yourself there, by the way. So just if you win the Ellen tickets and you live in London, <laughs> you got to figure out how to get here, honey. Because <laughs> I ain't picking you up. All I want for Christmas is a lifetime Wait, supply of Croc socks. 69? Oh! What I happened? Just, I just gained an extra chin. <laughs> Boop. Wait, somebody did something crazy. See? Jennifer Mominson, a thousand dollars. Oh my gosh, oh, Jennifer! Wow. Jennifer, Jennifer, Jennifer. Holy smokes. Jennifer, Jennifer. Send her a froze toast. Girl, oh my god, you're gonna hit 70 and my wait. The website is broken. Oh no. There's a heavy load. <laughs> it says the website. Where's my camera? It says oh no. Oh no. Oh, oh no. no. The website. I can't even make my camera work. My camera's not even working. My camera's like, no, I can't handle this. It's too much information. <laughs> Hold on. This is wild. It says, this website is under heavy load. We're sorry. You can't even look at how many donations are going in because there's so many people donating. Um, a producer on Ellen, who's a really wonderful friend and sweet, supportive, wonderful guy, um, is offering us two tickets to the Ellen show and to use the Ariana Grande concert in Los Angeles. So everyone's spazzing right now and donating um, to Childhood Cancer, which is just amazing. So, um, but the website's broken. <laughs> I can't load it. it it's won't load. Oh no! We're sorry, too many people are accessing this website. Seesaw, seesaw. Seesaw, seesaw. It means exactly it's what It's like yada, yada, yada. Oh my gosh. Seesaw, seesaw. Here we go. 69,400. Oh! Okay, okay. Still giving away the Allen tickets right now. Yes, we're still trying to give away the Allen tickets. Oh my God, remember 70,000 was just a faraway dream? And I was like, we'll never make it. And, now and then Ariana and Allen stepped in. Oh my gosh. I'm my baby is has isn't even kicking. Like he's usually kicking <laughs> oh. all the time. He's so stressed that he's like he's just tense. <laughs> I low key would cry for the socks. Um okay. I'm, oh my gosh. I'm trying to find someone who lives in Los Angeles. And it was donated and who wants the Allen tickets? Oh my gosh, this is so hard. I'm gonna have some people that would take me. Let me see. Oh, I'm, I'm just being fun. This one's for you. <laughs> What's that? Let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> Um, Dave, this is so I'm hard to do. Go on. Let's go. Um, oh my gosh, this is this is really stressing me out because it's such a good prize. I feel like people are gonna be mad at me if I pick the wrong people. No one is the wrong person. I know. Okay. 
Um, Joy Savan wants it. Huh? It's just weird. Um, yeah. I've tried. It's, well, that's Alan, because I call him Alan. Oh, I was like, what? I don't know. This is so freaking hard, guys. I don't know what to do. I'm sweating. I feel like I'm going to throw up. I'm so stressed. <laughs> um. Okay. Oh, my God. Three hundred Less than $300 more, so 70000 I got a lot to give away. I got to hurry up. Yeah, you do. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Rachel, talk more about talk about more about when you were on Ellen. While I was feet. on Ellen. Come and on, try. I had to help me buy shoes because they were like, I walked in in my flip flops, and this guy stopped me and my friend was like, "Hey, would you like to be on Ellen?" We were both like, "Stop speaking. What do we have to do?" <laughs> and he was like, "We're just gonna describe what hang out for the next hour in Target." We're like, "Easy, it's Target." But we were wearing flip flops, so we went and we bought shoes at Target. So that because we're like, we have to run. Yeah. So we bought shoes, and then afterwards, I didn't win this Cavalier Hunt thingy, but they did give me gift cards, and oh, and one, you had fun. I did. One of the gift cards didn't work, though, so I ended up paying more because I bought shoes yeah. and I won in the end. But I didn't care because I had so much fun, and they're really nice. Like you did great. Here's some gift cards. That's so but cool. that was it and then it aired and everyone was like Rachel your butt crack I was like oh no. my god <laughs> I was wearing a minion shirt that day too I was looking good I was looking <laughs> real good alright did you find okay. one you look like you did you did that half I don't know I do, it. do it do it this is stressing me out she looks nice oh my god less than $200 till 70000 oh my gosh okay so I think moose Show them when you're beautiful I'm really face. Out. I'm really stressed out. You know, I have to do this again for the Ariana Grande tickets. And the ukulele. Oh my God. Um, okay. Hold on, I think I found someone. I'm very stressed out. 70,000! <laughs> This is, wait, I lost her. Oh no, that's really sad for her if I can't find her. Coley, can we like celebrate because she's so freaking I'm out so about picking a person? I don't want anyone to be mad at me if I don't pick them. Listen, yeah. just pick someone and it's gonna be the same outcome. No okay, what? here we go. I'm just gonna pick this girl. Go. Okay, name is Danielle. Anyone that. who's named Danielle right now watching is having her. I know. Um, at heartbeat underscore love, she said, I'll screenshot her. Um, she said she could only donate $20 this year, trying to spread the word as much as possible. She lost her grandfather to cancer. It's the worst. The thought of kids going through this is not fair. She lives in Arizona and can get, her, can get herself to the Ellen show. I would cry if I won Ellen tickets. My mom and I have been trying for years to get tickets. Yes. I've never won. Take your mom. Yes. I've donated a few times, and this would be a dream come true. So there you go. Yay. Danielle. Oh, God. Am I done? No. no. <laughs> this is so stressful. <laughs> okay. Ariana's next. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're at 70,000, so I can just give away these other things. Over 70,000. Girl. But keep, I keep, 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 keep it going, y'all. Keep it going. We can get it. That is crazy. I'm All right. I'm going to take it and socks. And socks. <laughs> <laughs> okay. My goodness, this is very stressful. Let me look. How did you kick the dog? You kicked the toy. I was like, toy. Looking at Fundly. You're on Fundly? I'm on everything. I'm just I know like, you are. You don't know where you are anymore. Really stressed because I have to pick someone else. I literally feel like I'm going to have diarrhea, which would be a miracle because I haven't pooped in eight months. Um, is this, are you in labor? <gasps> is that what it is? I don't know. No, know. it's not squishy enough to be, or it's too squishy to be Braxton Hicks. How she needs to get lower. No, I don't think I'm in labor. I thought maybe I was having Braxton Hicks, which is why I was feeling gross. Because it is kind of firm. I don't know. Mom, feel my tummy. Tell me. I think it's usually harder when I have Braxton Hicks. If we hit 80,000, Colleen will go hard. into labor. <laughs> <laughs> and she'll right? pick one of you to name the child. It feels hard, right? Yeah, it does. It is hard. All over. It's not moving at all. Okay. You want to drink something cold real quick to wake him up? I have not I'm doing coke. No, but usually I do ice water. I know I chew on ice, yes. Do you want me to get some ice? Let's fill this with ice and water. 
Perfect. Thanks, girl. Thank You're the best. Crushed ice. Crushed ice and water, Dad. All right, so I'm right, giving away two down. tickets to the Ariana Grande concert in Los Angeles right now. And you need to get yourself to Los Angeles or you need to be in Los Angeles. And I don't want nobody being like, oh, I can get myself there. And then you don't get yourself here. And then somebody who does live here could have gone to it. Yeah. Or someone who could have gotten here. Like that girl is from Arizona, but she said she can drive here. Arizona's driving cool. Oh, now he's moving. Oh, there you go. He heard the ice. Yeah, he's like, yeah. You're awesome. Diarrhea is a sign of early labor. Yeah. I told you. Yeah, the doctor or that one person was like, it, it, it clears your body first. Yeah, you poop and you pee and then baby. And sometimes you do it when you're pushing. Yeah, sometimes at the same time. But it's easier to get the baby out if you yeah. empty all your systems. Yeah. Ow, now he's this. really thinking. Ow. Oh my gosh, Good she's boy. coming. He's like, you want me to wake up? <laughs> he's coming. You think you're going to disturb my slumber? Oh my God. He's I'm literally. Really hard. I catch. Um, oh my gosh. Well, he's Thanks, rolling Pops. around. All right, looking for someone to give those Ariana Grande tickets to. Whoa, holy smokes. He's a maniac right now. It was like it was really hard, and the second it yeah. got unhard, he like is like. Oh, he couldn't move because it was like pushing. Your foot right here, this little lady. His oh. little foot. His little foot right there. Samantha said, "Please don't go into labor." Please. Oh well, yeah. It's too that early. must be his cool. Story. That's him. Yeah. In two weeks, let's be right like, here. let's go into labor. Let's just flip. See how high it is. He's he, he, my he ribs. Is way up there. Oh, he's so cute. I can't wait to hold him. I know, me too. He's gonna be squishy. I'm gonna kiss his face. You gonna have so many rules. You gonna squish. Oh, kind of ice cube. Oh, good. We're at seventy thousand seven hundred sixty-seven. Wow, Jeez, Louise, that's wild. Um, trying to find someone to go to LA. Who lives in LA? Who can go to the Ariana Grande concert? We're giving away two tickets to the Ariana Grande concert. Or lives a drive drivable distance from LA. Mm -hmm. And you have to find your own accommodations. Yes. Mm -hmm. You can tell me about it on my Twitter. And now I'm checking my Twitter. Be like, oh my gosh, I can get to the Ariana Grande concert. This is how much I donated. See, look it. Or I spread the word about your thing. This is it. See, look it. A lot of people are wanting the ukulele, which is the final thing we're doing. The finale. I love the random tweets I'm getting that have no idea we're doing this live stream right now that are just like commenting on other things. I'm like, what are you talking about? <laughs> it has nothing to do with this. I'm gonna be a man. Yeah, I see people just wanting the uke right now. Yeah, me too. Uh, ah, this is hard. Everyone's helping me, right? I'm looking. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of people are wanting that ukulele. Well, because a lot of people can make it to a concert. Yeah. Um, okay. Man, I just went away from it. We need someone to tell a story while I'm looking. Oh my gosh, this is really hard. Oh no, I have to go through this again. I'm gonna literally go into labor from stress. <laughs> Help me out here. What should we do right now while I'm looking for a winner? I don't know. Look at these graphs. Graphs? That's what I should. My, my ear is so itchy. Mm. Is that a sign of labor? <laughs> I think that's a little weird. I thought Coin said us already, but for family reach, um, over the years, I'm Colleen, and you guys um, have helped 118,000, <laughs> 118,000, wait, 118 families for housing, 43 families with utilities, 39 families with transportation, and 19 others. So that's a ton of families that you've all helped. So congratulations to you all. Yay. Thank you so much for helping out. Oh my gosh, I'm very stressed. This is hard. I told you. And all the, they sent us a breakdown of like every single person, every single family that they've done. And like they've been 
you guys been helping families like this since 2016. Like that's, you guys yeah. have been doing a great job. Oh my goodness. You guys are crushing the game. I can't believe how much we raised. This is wild. Um, someone wants a banana chip. No more banana chips. They're not good. Oh my goodness. Oh, maybe one. You did? Let me see. Maybe? Okay. Yeah. What the heck? We're at 71,000. <gasps> Oh my I haven't done any research yet. This is the ukulele. Do some at research. Age. We researched you guys, by the way. Yeah. Um, I'm almost there. Because I'm on to your little tricks. I, I Who's tricking? Just sometimes people trick. So I do a little research. Hey, don't trick. No trick or treating. That's going well. Wow. It's, it's not. It doesn't look like that lid's on. Oh, you're It's not because I'm eating ice cubes. Okay. I know it's boring right now, guys, but we're trying to pick a winner for the Ariana Grande tickets. I'm trying to focus. Focus on me. Focus on me. Uh, this person seems a, a good candidate, if you will, if you'd like to. Let me see their thing. We perhaps have found someone. Whoa, let's exactly which one. It goes down for a while. Let me just look. I'm doing some research. This is a big okay. prize to make sure you're legit. It's not showing up online. Maybe they've blocked you. What? Well, if you blocked me, you can't. That's it. Okay, let me look. Rachel, you have to say something. Oh, my God. I just found. I, I, oh, my God. So, um. Have you been to an area? I've actually never been to an Ari concert. Which is strange. You have. I have. I've been to two. I think one was Jingle Ball and one was. I got invited. She invited me to the Jingle Ball one, but the day before, the like day of, or no, the day, night before I got in a car accident and she texted Colleen. She goes, Your sister's still totally welcome to come, but it's going to be loud and it might stress her out. And I was like, Yeah, I'm not going. Yeah. <laughs> you weren't going anywhere. Yeah. But her concerts mm -hmm. are amazing. She sings totally. live all the time and kills it every single show. Yeah, she's incredible. Yeah. And it's like, it's crazy when you watch her live because you hear the songs on the radio. I'm like, oh, that was a good riff. But then, like, she does different crazy riffs. Like, yeah, in she the goes show, off. Live, like, she just goes off. Like, she's just showing off. Like, go. Yeah. Okay. <gasps> yeah? Wait, I don't know. Oh. Oh, hold on. <laughs> because look at Well, she said in that one that it's. See that simple? Okay. And uh, mm. I know, I know. It's hard to pick. I know, I know. Almost there. Okay, guys, give me set a timer for two minutes. And if I don't, in two minutes, I'm going to announce a winner. If I don't find someone, I think we might have found someone. Siri, set a timer for two minutes. <sighs> this is really stressful. Let's see if she does it. Okay. Okay. Timer is set for two minutes. Siri did something right. <laughs> Oh, I can watch the countdown. What that? Time for. Time for. Ask Siri. I'm going to need a nap after this. The, the amount of stress picking someone is, it's so hard. If you can sleep, sleep. <laughs> um, I'm so thankful for my ex. So everyone who's watching right now, Thank you're oh, watching. Yeah. Colleen's live stream, uh, we're raising money for childhood cancer. The money goes to Family Reach. It's an organization that gives um, money to families that are um, dealing with a child that has cancer. The money also goes to uh, the Children's Hospital of Los Angeles so they can do research on how to find cures, to find better medicine. Um, and then Colleen also donates personally to... Uh, patients that she knows and she also donates a huge chunk of money to um, the charity as well so that's what we're doing right now and we're giving away really cool prizes right now what are we giving away right now we are giving away two tickets to ariana's concert ariana grande's concert in los angeles um 
these tickets were graciously donated to us seconds ago. Um, by the Ellen Show. The, so technically, Ellen is giving you tickets. To see. Well, Ellen, <laughs> uh, uh, the producer that works on Ellen, who was really, 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 really sweet, amazing man, is um, helping us out. And so, yeah, so if you would like to go to Ariana Grande's concert in Los Angeles and you're able to go, you live close by, you're driving because we can't afford to pay for your housing or travel, um, you can donate to the Fundly page. Uh, that is, and it's the link in Colleen's description. It's all over the place. Do it! All right, it's time for me and to choose. Win. Okay, are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? So, wait. <laughs> okay. Here we go. The winner is going to be a girl named Caitlin. Caitlin248 on Twitter, spelled K I K A I T L I N 248. She said it's her fiance's birthday on May 7th, and it would be such an awesome present to go to Ariana Grande concert. Be a perfect excuse for us to travel. We love to. She's lost four loved ones to cancer. She's the mm -hmm. strongest woman I know. And the reason I chose her is because she donated, um, uh, I think, $10. But then she also was retweeting, um, you know, me and Eric and a bunch of people about the fundraiser and trying to get people to watch. Um, and so she was spreading the word, too. And she wasn't just trying to. And she also retweeted Ellen three hours ago. Before she even knew. Well, it's Ariana, but still. But she yeah. was tweeting stuff about Ariana. There's a lot happening. We, I did research is all I'm trying to say. I saw you when we did research. I'm Rosanna sure you're not Pancino. Um, love Rosanna. All righty. So one final thing to give away. Congratulations. Yay! And socks. You and also socks. want socks. All right, one last thing, and then it's done, y'all. And right now we're at seventy-one thousand six hundred twenty-five dollars. Let's get to that seventy-two, girl. I'm gonna sign this right now. Oh my God. Where should I sign it on here? Yeah. Well, how are you doing it like this? this. So then and down, let me yeah. tell you, this isn't like a cheap ukulele no. that you buy at a dollar store. This is like hundreds of dollars. The stress of writing my name on this is really freaking me out. Colleen has. <laughs> Use this ukulele many times. I mean, this is a good prize. Well, it's kind of sloppy. There's my name. It says love queen. And the N is not like a perfect, it's like, it's not very cute. So I'm sorry, but you watch me do it live. That looks like a two year old did it. So you're welcome. Look at the N. It's like, <laughs> um, okay, there we go. So this is the next prize. Welcome to another stressful decision for me. <laughs> the last one. Yeah, and socks. And socks right here. Should I play a song? Uh -huh. Yeah. Somewhere over the rainbow. Didn't you used to play that Ariana Christmas song? Yeah, um, the, oh, what's that song called? Snow in California? No. The one she was on her um, Christmas album last year. Would it this Christmas? Yeah, on Would It This Christmas. Oh, it ain't even cold outside. Now we're home. The night is late July. Under the sun. I don't remember the chords. Oh. The jacket's all kind of love. The hands in the love. Not even a chance of rain, but my baby's in town and we're gonna do some better things. All right, so, but we could do a hug. Yeah, what are oh, these? Oh, yeah. I can play with concert. A hug. Give him a hug. What's that? It's on my phone. Draw them a hug. Heart. 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 Draw them a heart. 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 Something you drive in the heart. Keep it in a hiding spot. For a hug, give them a hug. People need hugs. Something to hold on to. A hug can really help a lot. Love, people need love. Give them your love. 
need your help. I don't remember it. What was this line? What? Da, 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 da. I don't even know my own songs. Oh, here it is. We're about to give this ukulele away. Cold outside, One more prize. It is Colleen's personal ukulele signed, and it's going to one lucky winner right now. And if you want to donate, you can donate to Funly for Colleen's childhood cancer fundraiser. Make sure you tweet her and show her that you donated so you could win right now. And can they donate later if they don't get their paycheck till Friday or something? Yeah, yeah, of course. If you would like to donate later, if you don't have money right now, um, the Funly page. It says that we have 55 days left. Um, I don't know how if that's going to be the case, if we're going to keep it open for that long. But we will be keeping it open after this live um, show. So if you want to donate after, you can most certainly do that now. Or if you're watching this live show on YouTube, you know, a week later or a couple of days later, you can still donate. Yay. Thank you, Oh, you're going to be spending a long time on that one. Huh? This one's very hard. I know. I'm gonna go grab some socks for myself. Yes. And we're gonna do some things. <laughs> and we're gonna do some win my things. I'm not. Oh, 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 we're gonna oh, pretend we're at the North Pole, pole. turning our heat into an ice cold holiday. Epic. <laughs> sounds so familiar. Um, okay. I literally need a nap. I feel like I'm gonna throw up. Okay, just at, so you have one more and then it's done. Uh, well, it's not done. You can still Well, you donate. can still donate. Who but has we have made one more prize. Three hours. Ooh, go. Who has been here all three? I have. How? I got you. Three? <laughs> it's, it's been so many hours that you have to pronounce the H. How? Three hours. Long. <laughs> It's how long this has been. The sun three? is like moved. The sun yeah. is setting. The sun is setting. Because it has been three hours. Three hours later. I still have to do my life. Oh my gosh, it's been today. over three hours. This is what I am saying. It's been a fun time though. My Everybody dog is probably healthy. pissed that I'm not home. I still have the podcast with mom later. We're doing that next. I have to pee again. I have to eat lunch still. Yeah. Download the SD card. Oh yeah, I gotta edit your vlog footage for Wednesday. Mm. You do another vlog? Yeah, she's gonna have a vlog once a week on my channel for just for vlogs. Good luck this time. You got a lot of footage, didn't you? Okay. It's just a mismatch. I love a mismatch. I'll just make fun of you. I figured. <laughs> mm. 
was lost. Oh my god. I've never seen that face on you. Yeah, Is there a special way you have to ship a ukulele? Ukulele? We'll find out. That's the hardest part about doing these fundraisers is Corey goes to the post office with a trillion huge boxes. So hopefully mom and dad being here today will be helpful and at some point, unless they're leaving right away. But um so many you. people get so mad at me, like standing in line. Like last time I, I was sending gifts out for Colleen, a woman behind me was screaming, mm -hmm. saying, Why isn't there more people helping? And I said, Excuse me, can you please calm down? She said, Mind your own business. Whoa. And I was like, You're in my business. You're <laughs> screaming right in She said, You're me. eavesdropping. Oh yeah, you're eavesdropping. Mind your own business. <laughs> I was like, how am I eavesdropping when you're literally yelling by my face? To a bunch of people. Yeah. This is very really oh. stressful. Okay, I've, I've narrowed it down to two people, I think. Let me see. Let me, I know what I'm so on it. Seen her. Um, I'm going to do the other one. I don't know if I've seen before. Well, you have. Yes. All right, set a timer for one minute. Oh my God. Hey right, Siri. 73,000. Set a timer for one minute. Woo! Timer set for one minute. All right, everyone, right, $73,000 donated to Colleen's Childhood Cancer. <laughs> ton of money we beat last year i think we raised about sixty thousand last year 50 so we, i think fifty thousand. so we i don't remember actually okay <laughs> we certainly 60 but then people retracted it was like 50 ended up being yeah. 50 something so we've surpassed that and there's no take backsies <laughs> no take backsies okay i think i've picked a winner before the timer even went on nice oh wow <sighs> oh, i don't know how to turn the timer off hold on me this is going to go to the final present for the fundraiser first of all before i give it away i just want to say thank you so much to everyone who's donated it's going to help so many kids and so many families in need and thank you for being here and doing this it means the world to me this is the best birthday present in the whole universe i can't believe every year you guys do this with me it's the best ever so thank you thank you thank you from the bottom of my heart and the winner is a girl named Jules. Kathleen oh. May. She said, music is a stress reliever for me and one of the reasons I've always wanted to learn to play the uke. I'm always borrowing my best friends and I would take such good care of yours and be so grateful to oh. win. I donated $15. I hope that helps. I love you times a billion. And um, then she tweeted about being stressed a few times, which I can relate. Um... So yeah, that was really hard for me to pick. If you didn't win anything, you still won because you are helping kids in need. So thank you for tuning in and watching and being a part of such a wonderful thing. We raised $73,000, $73,000. And that's not including what I'm gonna be donating to, um, which will be a nice big chunk of money. So we've raised a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of money today, guys. I'm so proud of you. And I love you. This is amazing, like kids and adults, but helping each other out. I never did anything like that when I was a little kid. So um, it really, really impresses me when you guys spend your last $5, your last $10 to help someone else. It means the world. $73,000. You guys are amazing. I love you. Have a wonderful day. I'm going to go into labor now. <laughs> and <laughs> thank you for watching. You guys are the best. And yeah, yay, we did it.